Welcome back, everyone, to the stream! Welcome in! Hi, everyone! Oh, hi! Hi, gozaimasu! Hi, gozaimasu! Komawa! Hi, everyone! Welcome back! Jaha, thank you for the tier one for eight months. Welcome back to the Shade Brigade Gamer. <laughs> thank you and welcome back. Good to have you back. Hi, everyone. How about that YCS that happened, huh? Uh, Arsenal, welcome in. Good to see you. Welcome back. Always good to see you again. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, Baron Kai, I did see your message in the Discord. I did see it. It's very cool, man. <laughs> Give us the good work. Can't wait to see that flame service deck. Anyone can special summon a level six or lower, though, if you have that one normal map card or whatever it is. But a pretty good deck, dude. Do more, do more good in the world. But hi, everyone. I hope you're doing well. How's everyone doing today? Jaha, how you doing? Greed, how's it going, buddy? Allie, welcome in. Allie, the bully. King of Fables, welcome! How's it going? Jack, I saw Satellite. Are we playing 2009? Yes, we will be playing Yu-Gi-Oh! World Champion... Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds World Championship Edition 2009 Stardust Crusader. Was it Crusaders? Accelerator. Crusader. I'm thinking of um, uh, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> Stardust Accelerator. I'm bad. I'm doing okay. I worked out yesterday, so I'm a bit sore. How are you doing, Junku? I'm doing all right. I uh, uh, just set up a working contract with the new artist. Dude, I'm seeing everyone pop off on, on YouTube lately. And I'm like, man, I need a piece of that pie. So I'm pretty, I think pretty soon we're going to have to start pumping out YouTube videos. I don't know, guys. My uh, my social life might go from 100 to zero very quick. But the, the amount of videos I produce might increase from 
zero to a hundred really quick, if you know what I mean. I might, I might be sacrificing my personal life or a career or a uh, more videos kind of type thing. So we'll see. It just depends on if the things I release get uh, the views that I want them to get. But yeah, I can't wait for the next Dual Dynasty tournament. Yeah, we're actually printing uh, the second place trophy right now. And we're also printing the uh, third place trophy right now. So once once we get those printed out, we'll be able to uh, we'll be able to start uh, doing the new next Dual Dynasty tournament. And then we'll have to do a custom ban list tournament to decide the Dual Dynasty ban list that's coming up for the next Dual Dynasty. I think it's Dual Dynasty 6 now. But after we come up with a Dual Dynasty 6 ban list, then we can run the 6th Dual Dynasty! Let's go! It's gonna be so much fun! I'm gonna have to find a co-host for that. Okay, everyone, settle down, settle down. Settle down, settle down. We're, we're going to need to come up with a... Uh, like a co-host for that. So I might need to ask some friends of mine if they'd be interested in helping me co-host that. That'd be really, really cool. It'd be really, really awesome. Yeah, I can't wait either. It's going to be a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, we finished. We finally finished Yu-Gi-Oh! Tag Force. Uh, but did you guys hear about the latest YCS? What happened at the latest Yu-Gi-Oh! Tournament? Uh, over at Las Vegas. You guys hear about this? You guys, gals, and non-binary pals hear about what drama went down at the YCS Las Vegas. So, uh, apparently in the tag duel category, or subdivision, whatever you want to call it, um, a team ended up getting second place. Not because they cheated or did anything crazy, but because one of the teammates said, God damn. One of the teammates said, God damn. And uh, they got banned. No, no, it's 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 a hundred percent true, Greed. It's a hundred percent true. They said, "God damn!" In the city of sin, Las Vegas, not even the worst thing you can legally do there. And they got banned because their opponent said, eh, "Judge, judge, he may hurt my he hurt my feelings, judge." Come on, man, are you serious? So pissed off. It's 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 completely bullshit, greed. It's it's just the worst, man. It's the worst. But I wanted to hear your guys' thoughts on that. I don't really play. I don't really play a lot of the uh like physical card game just yet because getting the cards is so expensive and I'm a content creator. I spend a lot of money on just like making videos and and clips and uh putting streams together, and I don't really have money for cards. Like if I wasn't uh making videos, I probably have more money to do that kind of stuff, but I just don't have the money to invest in real physical cards at this time. But, um, you know, may maybe if we get a little bit more popular, maybe I'll start going to maybe I'll start going to locals and recording some locals. If you guys would be down to see that or down to watch that, that'd be pretty fun. What a weird thing to get in trouble over. It's just dumb because nowhere in the official rulings is that like a thing. And for them to bust that out would mean they need to have set a precedent moving forward that all events uh, where there's swearing involved will lead to people getting banned. So there's a secondary meta now where if you get your opponent to swear, you can potentially get them banned with an earshot of a judge. It's just, it's just stupid. Like most of the people playing these card games are adults. So just like grow up, man. You know what I mean? It's just so stupid. Yo, Belfry, how's it going, man? We're talking about the latest Yu-Gi-Oh! Championship series where someone got banned for saying... God damn. And they got, they didn't get banned. They just got disqualified. And they took second place instead of first because of that, which is very, very, very stupid. But what are you going to do, you know? <laughs> what are you going to do? I would love to get into the local card game scene, though. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Uh, D yep, DQ'd for a GD. That's right. Yep. that That's absolutely right. DQ'd for a GD. <laughs> Ryan says, me getting banned from all Konami events for saying, what the hell? Oh my God. No way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice, Ryan. 
Nice. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to get your guys' thoughts on that. I, I've been sitting on that for a while. Fluttershy, welcome in. How's it going, Fluttershy? Welcome, welcome. Janosuke, welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome in. I understand there are children around, but it's all complete bullshit on this thing. Dude, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be really, I'm going to keep it up, up, up 50 with you. No one who's making it to tops is a, is a kid. Okay. <laughs> you don't make it to top, the top like 10 being a child. All right. You have the heart of a child. But, uh, but, but anyway. <laughs> Ryko, welcome in. How's it going? Junkie wave. Allie, welcome in. Hold on. Don't they have a junior divisions though? They do. They do. Yes. They do. I mean, if there's kids watching, okay. But like, if they said underneath their breath that it was an accident, whatever. They've actively let people cheat before and cost people the game. Like, they've, they've shuffled cards wrong and, and reset board states before and people have gotten away with much worse. It's just very stupid. I know kids who curse more than adults. Like, it's it's uh, it's uh oxygen to them. So, I don't know. It's, it's For me, I don't really play, like I, I was telling Ryan... I was telling everybody, I don't really play the physical card game too much because of how expensive the cards are. And I spend a lot of uh, money just, you know, getting content created and um, getting stuff put together outside of uh, just streaming, getting streams ready, preparing for re-debuts, VTuber stuff. If I didn't have that much money put into all these other things, I'd probably be going to locals and doing local stuff, but I don't have that, you know. Yeah, Raiko, you love cursing when you're... Yep. Yeah. And dude, like... Can we just be real? Like, the manga? The manga that they made for kids. The manga, the manga, the mangies. They had swearing, cursing, suggestive nudity, suggestive flirtation, suggestive uh, SA, like all, all kinds of crazy shit. But Mr. Man says the meme word and then he's banned. Like, like what? Huh? The first page of the mangi has a panty shot. <laughs> Rosebud, welcome in, welcome in. But I won't waste any more of your time, guys. Uh, let's let's swap over to the next thing here. Let me get it ready, okay? I will get it ready for the next thingy here. Uh, well, I suck at Yu-Gi-Oh, so swearing my behind off because I can't do shit correctly. Dude, I could never make it to Konami then because I'd be like, mother <laughs> son of <laughs> playing the race, you aces, you mother <laughs> ass blossom this mother <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> no, Konami, wait, 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 wait. Don't do it, Konami. Don't do it. All right. Um, I saw Akiza getting her back blown by Yusei in his garage, and yet they let this happen in the manga. Dude, I know, right? How could they do this? So disgusting. All right, let's let's swap over, chat. Let's swap over. Um. Whoop. All right, chat. I went ahead and made this premium, custom, uh, D D S loadout with with little cool things at the bottom here or uh, for people's most recent, uh, you know, follows, subs, all that stuff at the bottom. I went ahead and did a lot of cool stuff like that. So I already have this ROM like pretty much good to go. Uh, I mean, this video game that I legally purchased with actual money. Uh, and I have a cheat code put in to basically allow all banned cards to be used to make the game a lot easier for me. Let me know if you can hear it, chat. Let me know if you can hear this. Can you hear this? Woo! Let's go! Let me set up Juba real quick. And then uh, we should be good. Uh, Pot of Greed at three, uh, I think so, but I'm not gonna be using it at three. That's a little, that's a little too much for me, you know. All right, Chad, I just gotta organize this a little bit better.
Huh? I think that's good, right? That looks good to me. Yep. Looks good to me. All right. Let's get Juber in here. All right. Do you guys want... I'll bring Juber in, dude. Juber's like a staple of this channel at this, at this point. Um... Akira bike looks well made. Well, don't worry. We're going to get our own dual runner very soon. The hell are you, Juber? Um, there he is. I will leave him right here. He's not taking up any room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Someone want to test Juber out for me? Imagine drawing three pot of green in your opening hands. God, playing, uh, playing at what? Uh, freaking Exodia with three pot of green? Finally, Dad got me out of the box. I'll put you back in if you stop, go stop carrying on, dude. <laughs> you right the fuck back in that box. All right, I think that's everything we need. Oh, we don't have throwable set up on second. That's right, chat. I don't know what deck I'm gonna Junk use. You're the real king of the junkyard. <laughs> Thanks, Uber. Uh, I don't know what deck I'm going to be using um, because this is like 2009, so there really isn't a lot of archetypes that are too good just yet. Um, but we shall see. What in the world? Hold on. That's so much better. There we go. Yep, that'll do it. Okay, perfect. All right, now we can start. All right. Uh, I I don't I can't really think of any other better way to start this than um than this. So let's uh, let's start it right now. Time, chat. It's time. Let's uh start a new game. That's not what I meant to press. Um. Oh no wonder. No wonder that's not what I meant to press. Dad, do I get a chance to play this awesome game? Never. Come on, Dad, please. No. You know I can beat you anytime at any place. No, only I can Let's play this go. game. No. Leave me alone. Uh, yo, Duke, you. Uh, Yodi Q? Yodi Q, welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Welcome into the stream. Thank you so much for joining. If you'd like to hang out, please consider joining the Discord today. I'd love to get to know you. And thank you so much for joining our stream. Welcome in. You do not have a Minecraft server. Mother I keep forgetting not to press the continue button. <laughs> I'm a professional, chat. I'm a professional. And of course, we get to make. There we go. First start. I didn't get too far. I just tested out the uh, band card mechanic. I was able to get a graceful charity and a pot of, uh, I think, a pot of greed or a monster reborn or something like that. And my controls are all backwards. What is going on? Use you. Jeez, are you good now? Okay. Okay, much better. I don't know what was going on. USA! Um, 
I mean, you've already seen my PO box. I am in Kanzasu. Uh, Junkie planted in my ex-boyfriend's dimension? <laughs> Wait, what? In America. I am Junkudis. Ah, oh, be aware that the name you input and other various information about you will be publicly displayed on the internet and leaderboard. I don't know about that. I don't know about that information at all. I don't think that's accurate. You see and I used to date? Oh man, that is interesting. Oh, yep, there it is. That's gonna have to be it. It's the only spiky hair in the game. That's it, chat. That's it. Did you know that Fiber Jar has never been unlimited in hey, any Jack, video game? Did you know that oh, Fiber my. Jar has never been unlimited in any Yu-Gi-Oh game by default and banned in most of them it appeared in? Also, are you hyped for the 04 event? Yeah, I can't wait for the 04 event in Master Duel. I'm going to be playing the shit out of that. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I can't wait. Uh, I think you're thinking of Dimitri. Gun voltings. Oh, but you broke up to him having a... Uh... All right, well, first of all, you say it's not real. Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna stop you there, buddy. You cheated on me with his motorcycle. That makes sense. All right, uh, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the World Championship. I wish Bulma was real. <laughs> Uh, Eternal Sith, I don't know what you're referring to, but welcome in, man. Change image. We're going to go ahead and you can actually change the hair color in this. We're going to make it blonde, make it my color blonde. You know what I mean? Let's do this. Well, that's pretty good. That's pretty good, right? I like that. Is that pretty good, chat? I don't know. Yeah, there we go. A little bit more saturation. There I am. Oh, I can even change. Oh, you only have one outfit. All right. Uh, are you not Junkrat? No. Uh, otherwise, my name would probably be Junkrat. Uh, but welcome in, man. Good to see you. I'm thinking I'm going to go for a pink coat. Yeah, that looks pretty dope. I like it. I like it. I can rock the pink coat. Yeah, there I am, chat. Perfect. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What about dual discs? You can buy stuff with stars later on. Really? Oh, sweet. Uh, what about... Hold on. Uh, can I change my dual disc? Uh, 5D standard dual disc. Okay. Interesting. Okay, that's sweet, though. Edit fixed text. I think this is one of the first games that let you do this. You can actually change the set of dialogue that your character says while they're dueling. Uh, which is very, very cool. And don't worry, chat, this series will also be up on the VOD channel, uh, no matter how long it takes. So if, you, if you're interested in watching, make sure you subscribe to the VOD channel. All our videos are up there from the last Yu-Gi-Oh! series. I want like a army dialogue set? What the hell? I want like a punk, like a master. Oh, there you go, punk, sweet. Bring it on, my turn. How about this one? Go have some fun. Take this. Kneel before me. Check out this spell. Too bad. For, okay. Ouch. That smarts. Ow, that hurt, you know? I don't think I would say ow, that smarts if I ever got punched. Look at that punk junk dialogue theme. I know, right? It's perfect. I'm not going to say anything if I get a little bit of damage. I felt that. That was pathetic. Are you even a duelist? Oh my god. <laughs> that was pathetic. Are you even a duelist? Holy moly. Time to get real. I love that. Uh, you can get stars for dueling others in free duel if you win against them. Speaking of dueling, let's check out our deck and see what we got to work with here, okay? Uh, let's change our format. Okay. Uh, Toon Warrior, X-Saber, Dark Valkyrie, Dragon Ice? What the 
Oh, so I'm just using a random pile of cards. Oh shit, are you serious? At least I got three mecha bunnies. Oh my god. Quick question, do duelists generally feel pain in their life points? Can you take it away? I think so. I think they all just act. What is going on here? Oh, I got the calculator. Okay, calculator's based. The creator. Tr oh, twin barrel dragon. I got some worms in here. All right. Not aliens, but worms. Okay. Oh, no. I have counter counter in here. Huh? Oh, my. Emotional damage. Oh, this, this card sucks, Jet. This card sucks. <laughs> Negate the activation of a counter trap card and destroy it. Oh my god. Wow, unstable evolution. Really? Oh my god. Cup of Ace! Okay, so we really just have the worst cards I've ever seen. Wow. Okay. Okay, uh, and we have a side deck. So, here's what I'm going to do, chat. I think we're going to go buy some cards. All right, chat. Now, if if my, if my the mod I used works well, forbidden card and limited card list should be completely empty. You ready, chat? There it is, chat! September 2008 ban list. What's that? What's on the ban list, chat? Absolutely nothing! That's right! Nothing on the ban list! Everything is up for grabs! We can use anything! Any OP strategy is at our disposal! <laughs> now, do you remember back in 2008 when everything was legal? Wasn't that a crazy time? Best way to win is if you have 40 cards in the deck. I won't be listening to that. Basically, everything beyond the OG Yu-Gi-Oh stage was performance. Wow. All right, well, I guess um, we got to get some cards, right? Okay. Dark Beginnings set one and two. I think I'm going to need some cards from this. I think all the elemental searchers are in here. I think I want to get some UFO turtles. I think I want to try to make a Laval slash whatever deck. I want to be that fire duelist, you know? A fire synchro duelist, but uh, it's gonna be hard to get anything coherent. But uh, I think I'm just gonna dump it into Dark Beginnings one until we get a full pack of Dark Beginnings cards. Okay, sound good, chat? Or at least until I get what I want. So let's uh, buy some cards. Yeah, I'm Hunter Pace, basically. Yeah, yep. You already know. All right, let's see it. Tonaskis, welcome in. Ooh, okay. Oh, yo, are you serious? Call of the Haunted? What? Hey, yo, first five cards and I get Call of the Haunted? That is really good. Mahavalem, Change of Heart! I got Change of Heart! Are you kidding me? Huh? Bruh. Oh my god, that's amazing! What the hell is going on? <laughs> Holy shit. That is really good, chat. Change of heart. Oh my I'm so happy right now. <laughs> Dust tornado, okay. Basic removal. Not bad, not bad. Man used up his all his luck for the year. No! Toon Seat, oh, there you go. Toon Summon Skull. Okay, the luck is the luck is readjusting, chat. The luck is readjusting. Oh! We got Gaff. Goblin Attack Force. That's that's pretty decent. 2300 body. In the early stages, it's going to be really good. Fissure! We got removal! Oh my gosh! We can do it, chat! We can do this! Hell yeah! And we got an Upstart. Good for a 40 card deck. We have another Fissure and a Gaia Power! Bro, I'm going to crush. Painful choice. Painful choice. <laughs> no way. 
I have the painful. I oh, we got premature bear. <laughs> we got premature bear. Holy hell! Hitson, welcome in. Oh my gosh, chat. Not a bad set of cards we just pulled. Wow. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Painful choice, just power creeps, premature burial. Honestly, I'm probably going to use painful choice, but I'm not sure how I'm going to use it, if that makes sense. Go ahead and empty the deck. That's it. You win. <laughs> I got a, a lot of good staples here, but I also have a lot of shitty cards. So we'll see. Let's, uh, let's add in some monster cards, I guess. I want to try to go earth for my typing. Get some earth cards in there if I can. Definitely add you. Definitely add you. Your uh, compulsory ejection device. Dark Valkyrie. Defense draw is pretty decent. Mm. Uh, I'll take Dust Tornado. Oh, enemy. You got Econ? I'm taking the Gaia power. Gaia Knight, Force of Earth. Fossil Tusker. I'll take a Fissure. Fairy Box! Playground Staple. Let's go. Wow. I'll take Gigantic Cephalotus. Goblin Attack Force. Ooh. Yo! Grand Monarch? We got a Monarch, chat. We already started with a Monarch. So that's pretty good. Lightning Blade. I don't know about that one, man. Ooh, Kunai? We're gonna need Kreebaz. That's a really good one. Jute Fighter. That's pretty decent, too. Ooh, Malevolent Nuzzler. Definitely gonna take Maha Velo. Magical Android. You know this card has not been reprinted since its original printing. So it's like a four... It's like a $100 card for no reason. Grand Mar... Grand Mar... Oh, homie. Homie, I love the way that you, you let me do stuff, homie. Wow, painful choice. That's that's going to be a good one. I'll take reinforcements. Uh, Radiant. I'll take Radiant. Add you in. Add you in as well. Barrow! Hey, how's it going? How's your character look at this game? Oh, I'll show you right after. Don't worry, buddy. I'll show you right after. Uh, we got some. It looks pretty decent. It looks pretty good. Sonic chick, I'll take. I already have removal. I'll take the calculator. Uh, once per turn, you can select one monster in the graveyard. Then send one card from your hand in the graveyard. To special summon that monster. Uh, yeah. We already have. That's gonna be our maximum tribute. So I don't want to get any more tributes. Uh, Toon Warrior. Yep. Twin Barrel Dragon. Yep. Uh, X Saber. We'll take you, you, and. I guess we'll take you because you're decent, question mark? Uh, actually, no, 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 no. We'll get rid of that. Oh, we really don't have a lot of monsters. This is a pretty decent flow. All right, here is our first deck. I'll I'll start with that. That's fine. I'll just look at our smart. That's great. We just started this series. It's a brand new series. Uh, this is what my character looks like, chat. If you wanted to take a look. This is me, chat. This is me here. I'll, uh, I'll even do you guys a favor here. I can actually uh, swap the screens. Wanted to get a better look at me. There I am, Dulles. There I am. Let's go. Dragon Star doing great. Welcome in. Let's go. I'm ready, chat. I'm ready to be in five Ds. Swap screens here. Okay. And I know we'll get better clothes as we go along, so I'm not even worried. All right, let's uh go to five Ds story mode. Enjoy these DS graphics, chat. Enjoy them. This is this is like an HD uh emulator too so it's like highest quality i can get it this is times 12 native resolution <laughs> this is probably gonna be the best let's play you've ever seen in this game oh you just beat hunter pace we're 
he won one one again today he's just too good no one can take his throne how long is his undefeated streak going to go on a living legend he's a one and only king jack atlas there's no denying i'm the king the goddess of victory smiles upon me Junk, when you get your jewel on there, you gotta give it a different color. What color would you have? Uh, maybe like silver or red. Something like maybe a mocking a peacekeeper theme or orange, like mocking a gear frame. Look at HD, the bottom screen is here, Jet. Oh shit, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh no, someone's lying on the ground. Hey, you okay? Pull yourself together. Roll credits. <laughs> you open your eyes to find yourself in an unfamiliar place. Where the f am I? Oh, thank goodness you came too. You all right? You're not hurt, are you? I'm fine, dude. It doesn't seem like you're injured. And it looks like you weren't attacked by any thugs. But it's dangerous around here, you know? What are you doing just lying in a place like this? Look how HD it looks, Jed. You don't want to answer me? We'll have it your way. Come to think of it, I've never seen you around here before. Where did you come from? Is Rally a girl or a guy? Oh, you really don't want to tell me, huh? Um, this is Satellite. It's a girl? Really? I did not know that. Uh, I've been giving it a male voice the whole time. I guess they used to call this place Domino City a long time ago. All right, I still haven't introduced myself. My name's Rally. so what's your name? What, you don't know? Are you nuts or something? It's your own name. Maybe you have amnesia. Oh, that's a tough one. So what should we do? Only well, had some kind of clue to go on. Hey, what's, what is that you're carrying? Oh, you mean this? My massive dual deck? My huge piece of dual tech? Yeah, I'm a dualist. So you're a dualist, are you? Yeah. Bitcoin girl? <laughs> my dual meat? <laughs> oh my god. And maybe you'll remember something if you have a duel with somebody. Why not duel with me then? I don't have my deck with me. So let me go get it. Just wait around here for a few minutes. I'll be right back. I gotta get the hell out of here. I look so cool, chat. Look how cool I look. Whoa! Whoa! Look how cool this is! Oh, it's a he? Okay. Rally is a guy. There are some points where other characters mistake him for a girl and he gets mad. Okay, I understand. Thanks for waiting here. Cool? Yeah, I guess so. All right, let the battle begin. Oh, it's the first duel chat! Oh, it's it's the first duel. Wait, how do I get a power level? I want a power level. What the hell? How do I get a power level? He's 515. I want to have a power level. This is bullshit. Oh, shit. Okay. We got plays here. I don't want to play anything too strong. I'm going to place this guy in defense position. We can't get it. Wait, what? We can't? It's always zero. Is that like an online thing? Wait, what the hell? Seriously? I can't get my power level up? Bro, that sucks. Thanks for the uh, explanation, Zypher. Really appreciate it. Oh, I'm so glad I set you face down. Look at that. Oh! Dude, look how cool the dual field looks. Hello! Oh, can I use my, uh, can I use my Kreebons and my Worm card to Synchro Sokun? I, I tune my Kreebons to my Worm Barsis to Synchro Sokun! Magical Android! 
This card has not been reprinted in like 20 years. Battle! Woo! God, I'm so good, Chad. I'm so good. Nano machine suck. Hell yeah! Wait, what? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Magical android. No one's been able to summon her. You should play card trooper on me. What are you? What are you trying to do here? You can't really do. You can't. You don't have enough attack points to beat over me. What? What? What's going on here? Oh, here we go. Twin barrel dragon. Come on, twin barrel dragon. Two heads. Let's go. Ah, oh, shit. All right, battle! This is what the 2004 event's gonna look like, chat. Woo! <laughs> Take that, loser! Yeah, apparently, um... Apparently not reprinted from his first set, so it's like a $130 card. Even though its effect is so mediocre and not good at all, because it's one of the first synchros, really sought after just because of the uh, limited printing. Limited prints, chat. They hike up the price of everything. Hello. You know, I will summon X Saber Galahad. You know what? I think I'm gonna call the haunted because I might as well. Just summon out my Kreebon so I can synchro Shokan one last time. Kreebons and my X Saber Galahad. Spring Kitsune, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. If you like to hang out, make sure you join the Discord today. I'd love to get to know you. And thank you so much. For joining our stream. Welcome in. Uh, I'll use attack position. Have you ever played Dark Duel Stories on Game of Color? You can make your own unique cards from parts in that game. Ow! You know, that was actually one of the things I contem contemplated playing before this game. Junky Wiggly, Junky Wiggly, Junky Wiggly. Okana, thank you for the tier one for 35 months. That's almost three years of junking it up. Welcome back to the Shade Brigade, gamer. Eight more subs and we'll go for an additional 45 minutes to an hour tonight. Thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it. Goblin Thief. Oh, he's actually going to play Mind Goblin. Frank Kitsune, I love these games. Yeah, I really, really wish they would have continued the trend of more single player Yu-Gi-Oh games with like stories and stuff where you're inserted into the role of the main character or like uh, a side plot to the story would have been huge. It, it would have been huge. I mean, I'd still be playing them today. They were out. Attack that face down monster. Woo. So sad they never did them for the XCs here. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't want, really want to be in a story with, <laughs> I wouldn't really want to be in a story in a generation where freaking uh, Yuya exists. <laughs> I really just like Yuya, dude. He's such, he loses so many duels. But uh, I do, I do wish they continued the game. I win! Let's go! Junk it up! It was really easy! Let's go! Yes, Jack! Equals it! Let's go! Wow, you're really good. Unbelievable. It's been a long time since I had such a fun duel. Yuma, not Yuya, my bad. Uh, thanks a lot. That was really cool. Yuya is uh, Arc 5, I think. So anyway, do you remember anything? 
remembered your own name. So you're junk. Well, nice to meet you, junk. That's it. I bet you'll remember other things if you duel some more. Well, my friends and I always hang out in a place that's not too far from here. If you go to the south, you'll find a subway. Eat fresh. There's always a place we meet up. I wish I could show you myself, but I got something to do now. But uh, don't worry about it, okay? I'm sure they'll let you in. They're all good guys, you know? You just need to say my name. I'll be back soon anyway, so I'll introduce you when I get there. Maybe you should do a little while you're waiting for me. Well, okay then, see you later. Yeah, I'll just show up and be like, yeah, I know this person, and they'll let me in. Sure. Old Domino City. Now a rundown junk town. Wait a minute. What do you mean by rundown junk town? What do you mean by that? Hold on a second. This is my town? Let's go! Without a trace of memory, you awaken in the back of a ghetto alleyway. This slum is home to bums and criminals who, exiled from the city, bear an inscription called a marker on their faces. It is then you notice there is a dual disc attached to your left arm, indicating that you are, in fact, a duelist! In the days ahead, what kind of destiny awaits you? Have you ever played dual monsters before? I don't know, Chad. Have I ever, have I ever played it before? Uh, I don't know. Yes. In this world, you'll find three types of duelists, each of which are conducted in a different manner. By mastering duels of varying styles, you'll be able to develop your talents as a duelist. Well, there you have it. Now, please enjoy your journey in the 5D story mode. I played Yu-Gi-Oh, but not Duel Monsters. Oh, you're right. What was I thinking? Now, Chad, this game is very grind-heavy to get new packs. So I might be doing grinds for packs off stream, uh, but I'll still be doing duels on stream and stuff. But, but yeah, let's let's go explore around this city. You know, looks uh, pretty shitty. What's up? That abandoned building in there is a big outlaw hangout. You should stay away if you don't want to get hurt. Wait a minute, this guy looks exactly the same as the last guy. I duel here a lot. I have to practice so I don't get dusted by others. Yeah. The fuck? Is the back of your hair a lemon juicer? <laughs> it does kind of look like that, don't it? <laughs> I see it, I see it. Oh, what's this? Yo, our playset of Dust Tornado. I got you, sweet, thanks. Oh, what do you want? Go away! All right. Can we duel one of these guys? Chat, should we duel one of these guys? Yeah, they recolor a lot of characters in this game. I mean, I get it. Uh, I feel like I could take on some of these guys, but I, I'm going to keep moving through here before I do anything else. Let's see what else we got in this town. A lot of junk, that's for sure. <gasps> the kids live here? That place is a card shop. The guy who runs it sells new packs every now and then. But... Hey, you can't go buy one before me. Buy all the fucking card packs. We'll never get a single one. See buildings and people on the other side, but a rift in the ground blocks your way. Damn. That rift is like such a pain. You totally can't cross it. It's like the pits. People say that. People say it's the pits. Hmm. Hello? Strongest card is, uh, wonder which one. Uh, what's strong, what's strong in offense, or what was strong defense? I mean, probably strong offense. Oh, more card uh, Well, don't mind if I do. I mean, I'm already here, so. Uh, an amnesic duelist going on adventures to find out he's the owner of an entire city sounds very Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> I'd watch it. Junk, be careful. Be careful of what? Not afraid of nobody. That's Shining Angel, one of the elemental searchers. Pretty good. Yo, limited removal goes crazy in machine decks. Some characters in this game have Exodia. Really? Interesting. Ah, uh, interesting. Okay. Cool. Um. Let's see who else is out here.
Oh, another guy. I know all about the pipeline. Want to hear? All kinds of garbage comes floating on down it. It's like a big tunnel. That's where you say it gets out of. The trash pipeline. Who the hell? I'm not the kind of guy who'd let a place like this drag him down. I'm going to the city one day. Ugh. Hey, Junk, sorry I followed you while you were offline, but I had to follow because I saw a video of you and Victoria and I found you funny, specifically when she chased you around the bar. Hey, Ariel, that's really nice to hear. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. And don't, you don't have to apologize for following me offline. A follow is a follow, you know. I really appreciate it. All right. Um. Hmm. This is, this is how real duelist run, by the way. This is how real duelist takes it in stride. All right, I guess we should uh, advance the story. We'll advance the story for now, and then we'll do some duels afterwards. Hmm, I've never seen you before. So what do you want with us? Only our friends are allowed to enter the subway, you know? Huh? Really? What about him? Uh, he said he'd introduce everyone later, so we should just let you in first? Well, I don't know you at all, so no matter what you say, I'm not buying it. Also, I like how every person in this game talks with their arm up for some reason. Like, I don't know, like, if they're holding something. You understand what I'm saying? You'd better leave, no matter what. You can't come in. <gasps> oh, hey, wait a second. Is that a dual disc you're carrying? I was just getting bored around here anyway, so why don't we have a duel? All right, if you beat me, then I'll believe the story you just told me. Even if you're lying. Let's do it! Let's go, chat! Time to do it! With our big, blocky club heads. Oh! I, oh, so his thing is all... His thing is... His thing is weaker than rallies? Really? There's a Mohawk duelist outside one of the later shops who runs a negation deck. Literally, the troll face turned into a deck and shuts down whatever you try to do. Gives decent stuff, though. Oh, my God. And I didn't draw a single monster. <laughs> All right, I am my turn. There's no point in placing anything. Oh, my God. Armored zo What? No! No! Don't do this! Oh my god! I'm being destroyed by armored lizard? No! You know what? Here's the secret strategy, chat. Since I have seven cards in my hand, I can send one to the graveyard, and next turn I'll uh, set my uh, call of the haunted, and I'll revive my monarch. That's the real strat, chat. That's the real strat. Curse of Dragon? Yo, I like how the summon is really cool in the background. Like the summons, you can actually see where we're dueling. That's crazy. Oh, I can beat the shit out of Curse of Dragon. No problem. Don't worry, chat. We got this. That's his boss? Curse of Dragon's his boss monster? And they have really shitty cards out here in the boonies, huh? Ooh, okay, not bad. I'll take it. Set some cards. Ooh, look at that. Now I can start making use of our hand. Yeah! I in my turn. It's your move. Oh my god, alligator sword? Jesus, are you serious? Well, I'm activating Fairy Box. Fairy Box, the playground staple! He runs mostly weak monsters with equip cards that make, make sense his boss is a Curse of Dragon. Uh, nah, I choose heads. Heads always shreds, right, chat? Let's go!
That means you take a hundred damage. Woo! My effect activates. He called me a prick. Wait, what? Did he just call me a prick? Or did he say that prick? Okay. All right. I was about to say, you can't call me that. This is Yu-Gi-Oh, man. Hey, yo, got my lend you my reptile warrior. Oh, I did not mean to activate that. But you know what? I'll make use of him. Call it the hunted. I summoned my grandma's the rock monarch. Of course, it doesn't get his effect, but you know, whatever. Bro would be banned from the YPS. <laughs> YCS if he said that. <laughs> oh my God, Ryan, you're so right, man. The guy would be knocked out of here. Yeah, and the fight, yeah, they cursed a little bit. They say damn and shit. Don't worry, I'm pretty much running the same deck as this guy, but I'm just smarter than him in every way. <laughs> why does Grin Maju, or not Grin Maju, uh, why does the 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 Earth Monarch have like Grand Marge? Why does he have like ball sack legs? Do you guys see that? He's got like big ball sack legs. What's with that? What's the deal with that? Yet canonically, I probably have the strongest, and I mean the strongest Mecha Bunny that's ever been played. All right, random pop. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Uh, the raid. <laughs> the raid. Welcome in. You've already been following me for like months. Welcome in. How's it going? It was made in GX, so uh, fair enough. That makes sense. A random raid by a random pub. How is your stream, random pub? We're playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Five of these! World Championship Edition! 2009 Stardust Accelerator. That's the full title, and you have to say it every time. <laughs> every time! I can't play my shield crush, but that's okay, because I can just crush your defenses! Ooh, not gonna work, buddy. You still take the damage! Let's go! And then I'll attack you directly with... Oh, shit. No! I won't allow it! Woo! What were you streaming, buddy? Oh, man. The, the, sport, the four specific nightmares that anyone who beat this game knows of? I have no idea what you're talking about. But I will add this Malefic Nuzzler back to my hand, or back to the top of my deck. I can draw it next turn. And look at that, I still got a Mecha Bunny. I end my turn after I place a card face down. Lady Logan, what are you doing in here? I thought you had an ear infection. It's where he stores his card effect. Card effects are indeed stored in the balls, chat. We're going to activate enemy controller just to place some face or uh, in defense position. So we can target him with shield crush next turn. I don't know what that is, so don't spoil it, okay? Mecha buddy! Let's go! Yo, 500 damage! Mecha Bunny is such a good, like, first card to add in. Dude, that sucks. Uh, Mega Rat had problems with her ears a while back. We had to get them cleaned out. She let that ship build up too much because she wasn't she wasn't washing out her ears with soap enough. So I, I had to I had to get her some stuff to clean out her ear holes. She had to get medicine and stuff. Yep, 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 yep. It's the worst, dude, because. When you, when you get an ear infection, it throws off your equilibrium, so you just feel nauseous all the time. It fucking sucks. Because uh, there's like a cochlear. It's like something cochlear in there. The, the stuff that manages your equilibrium is like a fluid. So when it's off, it, you feel weird. Oh, we win! We just simply win. We're that good, Chad. Let's go! Go, my Mecha Bunny! Finish him off! We win! Let's go, gamers! You suck! Oh, 
Yes, you got me. Okay, then I'll believe you what you actually know, Rally. Oh, of course, you show up right away. Got her! Welcome in! Hey, Nervin. Ah, you guys were dueling, weren't you? We were talking about a stranger here, and I thought I'd drive him off, but he's pretty strong. Yeah, I know what you mean. We got a real duelist in our hands. I have a collection of random cards I got from Power Cubes at Walmart. See you later, Rosebud. We'll be here, okay, gamer? So, Nervin, let me introduce you. This is Jack. We met a little while ago. And Junk, this here's Nervin. He's one of my best buds. Sorry for down and get back there. Well, Junk, it's good to meet you. Say, Nervin, I think Junk has amnesia or something. Isn't that what we always do to remember? Amnesia, huh? You mean like the things you can't remember for the past? Well, that's a rough one. Thanks for spelling out what amnesia is for the kids. Yeah, Junk's name only really came back to us when he dueled. Besides the name, we don't really know anything else except that Junk is a duelist with a whole lot of skill. Yeah, I got kicked out of the YCS in Las Vegas for swearing. It's all coming back to me now. I said frick instead of one of the judges and uh, the rest is a blur. Well, Duel brought back your Junk's name. I wonder if Duel and all help bring back something else. Oh, really? Nothing at all? That's all right. I bet it'll come back soon enough. I was so confused, and then I saw the, cre the screen in the corner. Oh, yeah, there's two screens. Well, I better introduce Junk to the rest of the gang. You should do a, a, a YCS goddamn salty Splatoon SpongeBob TikTok. <laughs> oh, man. That is a that that would be an old one. And it would be so niche, you know. Cooper, welcome in. Yeah, buddy. We're doing a we're doing tag force. Oh, uh, Tag Force. Oh my god, I'm so stuck on Tag Force 3. And I was thinking of Tag Force 6. We are doing... I have to read the full title out, because it's a really long one. We are doing Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds World Championship Edition 2009 Stardust Accelerator. You gotta say the whole title, or it doesn't count. <laughs> Welcome in, Cooper. How's it going, buddy? <laughs> I think we're gonna try our hand at some of these duelists. You know, I've already I've already rocked two duelists pretty easily. I feel like I could molly whop anyone who gets in my way. And I think the first kid that I wanna beat is the one in the shop. Hmm, okay. Sweet. I'm gonna beat the crap out of this kid. I think he has Exodia? No, no way. He said, oh, Grave Keepers! <laughs> grave Keepers! Oh, you like the hair? Thanks! It matches me, right? My hair's a little bit cooler, but I'll go with what I can get. Bring it on! Grave Keepers, that's gonna be tough. But, Cooper, we're dueling with a special condition. I'm dueling with a, uh, a special code that allows me to use all the banned cards. <laughs> But I'm only going to use one of each of the band cards. But uh, yeah, I can use any of the band cards as I so choose. And I have change of heart. Give me this card. Woo! I'll flip them face up. And then I'll tribute them with Prime Material Dragon. Let's go! Now it's time for battle. I'll attack directly. What? No! Oh, man. What? No, he's so strong. I didn't even... Ugh. Oh, God. I don't think we're going to win this one. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's a good first card to give to somebody, you know? It'll probably carry them a while, too. Because it's a one tribute 2400. Very niche. The gang can cheat, so can you. Dude, these these duels are hard, if I remember correctly. Um, let's see if we can't knock out the competition. <laughs> Time to flip some flipping coins. Let's get. The, I think the Gravekeeper, uh, the Necro Valley, is gonna be much more of a trouble card than any of the Gravekeepers would be. 
No way! Yo, I, I never, ever get Twin Barrel Dragon's effect. Yo! Let's go! Attack that Gravekeeper. Now attack directly my Twin Barrel Dragon! What's up, YOLO Chicken? Welcome in. I cannot believe that. You know how unlikely it is for that to happen? And uh, if I remember correctly, from last time I played this game on my own, just kind of having fun. No! Uh, from last time, just having fun. Uh, you need to beat Duelist like five times to be able to, to really do anything. If I remember correctly. No! To be able to get like new card packs, you gotta beat them, I think, five times each. Uh, and there's only certain ones and they don't tell you which. So I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna have to duel everybody just to make sure. Okay, chat, we have Prime Material Dragon. Woo, let's attack. Give me your card money. I'm gonna buy so many card packs after I beat you up. Something else I really thought was really interesting as well, chat. When these cards battle, there's more art shown of them than that is available in the card art. So I wonder if they do the art first and they just crop around it. You know what I mean? I've always wondered if they just draw to the perimeters of the card or if they do like a full painting and then crop it around that, you know? Love this game. It's a great game, Ziggy. Welcome in. We're going to be playing it for a while while we, we make our way through. Yeah, right? Because like... This is a Japanese game, obviously. So is it something that they're like making from the actual portraits they get from artists? I think so. Attack! Take this kid's money infinitely was the best part about this game. hi -ya! Ooh, look at that Oyster Meister. Hmm, free token if it gets destroyed. You know, you're not really doing too much against me. I had to open my big fat mouth. Gravekeeper's servant? What? Ah, oh, crap. Synchro Sukun. I, I have a little five. I can make magical androids, so I might as well do it. Jokes on you, Gravekeepers, our deck is a random pile. We don't need the grave. <laughs> I wouldn't sound so proud about that, but it is true. I tune my Kreebons to my Oyster Meister and summon out Magical Android! Let's go! And because it was sent to the graveyard, I can summon an Oyster Token! Trippy P! Welcome in! How's it going? Welcome in! Thanks for the, uh, thanks for the follow and grabbing my... Hey, yo? <laughs> Welcome in! No! It's exactly 2400! Darn it! How could you do this? No! But thank you so much, Trippy P. Trippy P, if you'd like to hang out, please make sure you join the uh, Discord today. I'd love to get to know you. Thank you so much for being my third follower of the day. I really appreciate it. Welcome in. My oyster! No! I can't believe you oystered me! Oh, that's really good, actually. That might be pretty good. Um, I think the play here is to set this because all his monsters are going to be like above 1900 for the most part. So if he attacks that, even if I lose it, it's just an, a, a reason for him to attack into something. And for right now, I don't need the extra attack points. So I'm going to set that in case he gets too big for me. For now, we're going to attack Gravekeeper's Guard. You're... It's Gutter. You're... Sir. Oh, he's almost dead. I wasn't even paying attention to his life points. Oh, because I have so many. Because I'm getting 600 every turn for Magical Android. Please let me Gravekeeper Spy. <gasps> what? What? 
ace card? No! Oh, shoot. Haha! <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! I'm so smart, chat! I'm a good duelist! Did you get a clash? Why would you do that? I'm so smart, chat! Elite gamer! That's why I am a pro duelist! Editor's note, I am not a pro du <gasps> No way! Enemy of the Mahavelo? Perfect! Now I can equip my Malevolent Nuzzler that I saved to Mahavelo, gaining an additional 500 attack on top of the 700, but at 2750. I just put this to attack position. We might have enough life points to finish this. <laughs> Let's go! Fresh from Duel Academy. I am a graduate. Thank you. <gasps> no, it's not destroyed. Oh, no. That's not good. Well, I wouldn't have been able to beat him anyway, so it's okay. And I still have my level. I still have my Sonic Tick on the field. So next turn, I contribute it for Prime Material Dragon. Totally fine. There's nothing he can do. Oh, there's something he can do. Oh, no. But it's okay, because I could get my... You know what? I, yeah, this duel's over. Because I could get my Prime Material Dragon to go off. I'm going to add the Malevolent Nuzzler back to hand. Or back to the top of the deck so I can draw it next turn. And then the duel's over, and I win. So, yeah, I take a little bit of damage, but... Because of Sonic Chick, I can pull this out. <laughs> I draw, punk! All right, Prime Material Dragon! Come on out! <laughs> and then I'll play my Malevolent Nuzzler and equip it to my Prime Material Dragon to make it 3100 attack! Super Sonic Dragon! Attack! Finish this too! Yeah, we did it! That's way harder than I thought it was gonna be, but we did it! Nano machine Let's go! <laughs> Are you really even a duelist? That was pathetic. What are we? What are we nuzzling? We're we're being malefic with our nuzzle. Malefic nuzzler. Oh, I lost. Let's get some cards, chat. Let's get some badass cards. Hopefully some banned stuff. Uh, Cooper, just for a frame of reference, I have Painful Choice in my deck, Call of the Haunted, which is banned at this point, and Change of Heart and Premature Burial. <laughs> Already starting off really good, but I need that equalizer. <gasps> Molten Destruction is huge for our eventual fire deck that we're going to be running. So I'm going to try to run whatever Lavals and Flame Bells I can get. That's going to be huge. It's going to be huge. Great, change of heart is a great choice, dude. I use it in my deck even today. Great card. All right, cool. I love, uh, you guys know me. Anyone who knows me on the channel, I'm a huge fire fan. I love fire cards. Even before Sinful Spoils came around, I made them really popular. Oh, come on. Any rare. Laval is not out yet. No, there's 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 Flame Bell, but no Laval's. So I'll be making like a Flame Bell-ish deck with some cool stuff in there. Ooh, Hayabusa Knight. I actually might add that to the deck. Confiscation! No way! Confiscation? Pay a thousand life points to get your opponent's hand and select one and discard it? That is great. That is awesome. Okay, adding that to the deck. Mad Sword Beast, adding that to the deck as well because it has piercing. Yep. We're going to add Ma Mad, Pierce Mad Sword Beast, Gear Freed. We're going to add Confiscation. Wow, my deck is already getting stronger. Look at me, chat. I'm just a great duelist. If we got Flame Build Fire Dog, we're cooking. I don't think we do. I don't think we, we're limited to a lot of the fires we got, but I, I want to be the fire guy in like every game I play because they don't really have a fire guy in a lot of these games. I kind of want to be that guy, you know? Uh, let's get rid of you. Hmm. Add in confiscation. Such a good band card. Down the road, that molten destruction is gonna be nice. Yeah, it's all about setup right now. Like I'm trying to get some UFO turtles. 
I can have some floaters for some additional effects and just getting all those cards set up now is going to really pay us off in the future. All right. I think that's good. We don't really have any other things we can equip or use. Yep. Good for me for now. How do you cook your meat? What do you mean? I don't understand the question. Uh, like what temperature? I usually never go farther than medium well. Medium well is my maximum rarity. I usually go medium or medium well. I cook my meat. I like it a little pink in the middle, you know? Grilled, smoked, fried. Uh, I fry a lot of my chicken. A lot of my chicken I fried. Um, I grill my steak and my meat. Uh, let's do this guy. You want to get a taste of just how powerful I am, huh? That probably has a stupid deck. This town used to have a fire guy. He owned the place. Nobody knows what happened to him, though. <laughs> it's me. This junk town is actually mine. Oh, my God. This guy has seen better days. Oh, man. He's got like a pant leg ripped up. He's got purple hair that stretches outwards. He, he's just he's not he's not the kind of company you want to bring home to your mom, you know? All right, what kind of dumb deck is he running? That's what I want to know. Ditto! Ooh, not a bad set of cards here. I think I'm gonna play Ancient Gear Knight, actually. Hill Zone, like Green Hill Zone, like Sonic. Oh my God, Chad. Green Hill Zone deck? Is he running a Hedgehog deck? What are you running? Oh, you're not gonna show me? Okay, I'm gonna normal summon the Ancient Gear Knight again to get the spell and trap protection during the battle phase. <gasps> Backfire? He's running a fire deck? Yo, really? I see your hand. <gasps> oh my god! He's running flame bells! <gasps> what? This guy has my ideal deck! What? What the hell? Oh my do! Oh my god, no way! Yeah, yeah. What in the world? Of course I gotta get I gotta get rid of the heavy storm, right? Flame Bell Fiend is crazy though! Oh my god! Oh, um I'm gonna re-normal summon the ancient gear knight. So he can't activate speller traps during the battle phase. Oh, there are flame bells. They do exist, Chad. They do exist. Look. Oh my God. I'm so happy that flame bells exist. I can actually run them. He's got Spirit Reaper. No. Oh, actually, that's not too bad because I have a spell card that can target the Spirit Reaper and destroy him. So he won't get that flame bell fiend in the hand. Don't even have to buy him. Just rob this guy. <laughs> hey, man, give me all your cards, you loser. Okay, he obviously drew a trap card. That's Spirit Reaper face, Dad. We have removal. We just got to do stuff to get that removal. I'm going to play Gyafri Dono. Time to enter Battle Lee. No way, Spirit Reaper. No one's ever been able to summon him. Anyway, main phase two, Fissure. <laughs> I'm pretty much the bandit Keith in this universe, Chad. I will shake you down for your cards. I will rip them in half. I will take all your lunch money. And you will be happy to give it to me. No! He's gonna get Flame Bell. Shit, I'm gonna get Flame Bell. Damn it. All right, we can get a level seven out right now with Toon Warrior. What do we wanna get? Um. Uh, let's do it. Love the shorts you're adding to YouTube. Hey, thanks. Yeah, I really appreciate that. I've been uh, trying my hand at like edited content that's off of stream. And I want to do, I really have a desire to make videos about Yu-Gi-Oh, like Yu-Gi-Oh trivia that are shorts, but I'm not sure how I want to format those or how long I want them to be yet. 
but I do have a script written up right now for them. But I'm trying to, of course, lean more into the thing because like with anything when it comes to streaming, you want to niche out. You can get start developing that uh, one community and then you could branch out whatever you want later. Um, but uh, Yu-Gi-Oh is the thing I want to do. I think I've decided this year. So uh, I'm going to try more Yu-Gi-Oh shorts later. See if I can hit that core audience, you know? We could, oh, dude. Talk about SEO and all kinds of stuff. I could talk about that crap all day. That is so interesting. Ooh, Dark Valkyria. Val Valkyria? Grab Yu-Gi-Oh and take whatever audience you can find. Honestly, real. The uh, the uh, the VTuber uh, Yu-Gi-Oh liking community uh, that has not been niched into very well yet. <laughs> There's like five VTubers who are also play Yu-Gi-Oh, uh, and they're pretty noticeable in terms of size. And I I'd like to be one of them. Oh, look at this chat. We don't have to worry about the flame bell now because I can just summon Dark Valkyria again. Uh, Valkyria, activate the effect to gain a counter. Place a counter on the monster. And then I can get rid of it. Oh yeah, did you guys hear about Pokemon ZA? Do, uh, do you know Baffa? I've heard of Baffa once or twice. <gasps> was that? Oh my God, that was Morphing Jar? Holy moly. Oh man. If I duel this guy, am I going to get his card pack unlocked? Do I have to duel this guy five times to get his card pack? You know, I want flame bells right now. I'll do whatever it takes. Give me the flame bells. Yeah, who would have thought Gemini monsters would be carrying me right now? Oh, I know. I have a lot of friends, uh, Lady Logan, who do play Yu-Gi-Oh, but not a lot of people who are just like, okay, I am a U I am a VTuber, and Yu-Gi-Oh is my shtick. You know, I know Hasher, I know Doom, I know Ame is kind of that way. Uh, it's kind of falling on the Ame to be that way. No! Oh, no! <laughs> I can't believe this! Oh, my God. And then I know uh, Maple's that way, too. Am! Is that level limit area B? Are you serious? Oh, my God. Nothing makes a video more unwatchable or a stream more unwatchable than just saying, hey, you know what would be really cool? Making it to where you can only play one card per turn. <laughs> I have a solution for this, though. Yeah, Ruxian is really good. I like Walk Ruxian as well. He opens a lot of card packs. I summon Toon Warrior because he's level three and technically able to beat over your cards. Oh, brother, this guy stinks. No, Dimension Wall. Oh, my God. This guy does stink. Oh, no. He's got one turn before he gets level limit area B. No. Damn it. This guy probably hasn't showered in a while. Oh my god. I love how chat will roast a CPU for me. <laughs> so I don't have to do it. Uh, why stop at MST? Gotta get that Feather Duster since banned cards are allowed. <laughs> Honestly, I like the way you think. Psychic Commander. So it's like a really bad burn deck he's running. A burn fire deck. I still have some cards that can get through his defense. Are you kidding me? I hate this guy! Oh my gosh. It's not my day. Look at this. This is why I need clowns, dude. If I had a clown, I could pop a monster whenever he did this. What is he trying to do? Excuse me? You gonna play level limit? What? Uh, NPC? Hello? He's not playing it? Okay. Oh! <gasps> Oh my gosh, chat. Oh my God. Okay, so this is very bad. But I'm going to do an enemy controller here. The sacrifice of monster. So I can get out my calculator next turn and in the game. Now, if he has a card that does my life point damages back to me, 
and I'm done. For oh, no way! He's an idiot! He's an idiot! <laughs> 6,000 attack points! Oh, my gosh! Chat! <laughs> He's an absolute nincompoop! Oh, fear the calculator, chat! Never underestimate the might of math! <laughs> Let's go! Thunder, dude, could you have if he was machine? Oh my god, if he was machine, he'd be in every deck that I had. Oh, six times three? 28. Oh wait, no, uh uh six, twelve, eighteen, it's eighteen. <laughs> Just leave me alone, chat. Just leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't laugh at me. Let's get more cards. Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Don't. Okay, let's buy some cards and forget that I'm bad at math. All right, I want four card packs. Anyone? Battery Man and Thunder King were the only good Thunder cards back in the day. That's true. Thunder was hurting. <gasps> MST! That card negates. It's going right in the deck instead of uh, dust. Oh, we got another conscription. We can add that card to the deck if we wanted to. We got a polymerization as well. MST, baby! We got Yura B, baby! Playground staple, Yura B! Hey, honey, honey! Actually, good removal. The Liquid Duo! Our duo! Hell yeah! Oh my god. A minus two. Oh my god, chat. I don't think you understand how powerful we're about to get. So we're adding in the MST. We're taking out the dust trap hole. Or the dust trap shit. And we're gonna add in the liquid duo and MST. Hey, T Cooper, thanks for stopping in. You always stop in and say some nice stuff, and I try to stop it in your streams and do the same. So, have a good man. I'm, I'm I got a lot of videos to binge tonight when I'm sleeping. I watch your videos when I go to bed. I'll be watching your Eternal Duelist Soul uh, hack run, where uh, you know they added a bunch of quality of life improvements to it. So, thank you. I remember Spellbinding Circle. Oh, I know, right? Back in the day. Oh. So good, so good. Delinquent duo, yes! Did you know Spellbinding Circle does not exist in Master Duel? No, it. Shut up. There's no way it doesn't exist. Are you serious? Is it not craftable? Dude, we need graceful charity. That's what we need. Not bait? Okay, Ryan, Google this guy's balls. Make sure he's telling the truth. Ryan, Google this guy's balls. Make sure he's telling the truth. Mods! Bad him! All right, let's duel this guy. You wanna duel me? You got some nerve, you wise guy. We'll duel this guy and then we'll move on with the story. You got balls to be dueling me. You got balls. Not a lie. Really? Ask me? What the, what the hell's an ask me deck? Dude, start up. Oh! <laughs> Woo! Oh! <laughs> we got rid of God and a bribe card. Oh my God! That's really good. That's really good chat. All right. I am my turn. Oh, good heavens. I think this guy's the negate deck, right? Is this, the, is this the guy that has all the negates that everyone was talking about? 
We will see. I. Bro. Oh. Wait, what? Drastic drop off. Activate only when your opponent adds a deck card from their deck to their hand, including drawing a card. Your opponent discards one of those cards? Are you. Oh. Okay, I guess. I wish, I wish it was uh, a monster because I could have uh, reborn it there, but. Attack! This guy's gonna be easy then if he's all just a gaze. He's no monsters. Woo! I like how they gave each type of card a uh, like a battle animation. Like, look, the plant guy got teeth. This guy gets a sword, I think. Yep, they all get little attack animations based on their types. Isn't that awesome? Like the level of detail they did here. They have back sprites for every card. Like, think about the amount of work this must have taken to draw back sprites for every card in the game. And they have front sprites too. Full art. It's crazy. It's like half-baked counter fairy deck minus the fairy. Ooh. Another drastic drop-off. All right. Uh, if he doesn't negate this, I win. Let's go! I win already? Are you serious? Uh, Victor, you did this? Woo! That was so pathetic. That was the easiest duel I've had in the entire game. Easiest duel I've had in the entire game. I heard Spellbinding Circle isn't in Master Duel due to some card art right issues. Really? Wow. Interesting. You know, they programmed it right in 2004, but they can't do it in 2024, 20 years later. Interesting. Blasty, you beat me. You got some nerve. That duel was actually pretty fun. Take this card if you really like. You know, you're a real pal. I mean, you better be good. What the fuck? Junk obtained Voltanus the Adjudicator. What is that? Volcanus the Adjudicator? Excuse me? After one counter... Oh, it's a counter trap fairy. Okay. So he was on counter. After one of your counter traps has been activated and resolved, you contribute all monsters you control to special summon this card. If special summon this way, you can destroy opponent's cards. Uh, destroy cards your opponent controls equal to the, I'm guessing equal to the amount of cards. Uh, this is not a tag game, actually, my friend. This is a 5Ds game. Oh, up to the amount of fairy monsters you attributed. This is Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship! Uh, this is Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds World Championship 2009 Stardust Accelerator. It is a separate game entity from the Tag Force series. There's no tag duels anymore that I know of. All single duels, but there's a story mode. Let's go progress that story mode right now. Hey, Raleigh! Oh, who's that? Tank and Blitz, good timing! This is junk! We just met! Hey, did Nervin let him in? Of course! Even Double Spell doesn't exist in Master There's a lot of weird cards that don't exist. That's okay, then. I'm Blitz. Good to meet you. I'm Tank. Junk's a duelist. A duelist, eh? Hey, how about you duel with me? Hey, I was just going to challenge him. All right, I have to tank then. That's a promise. Since that's settled, I guess I'll go ahead and watch. Good luck, Junk. All right, let's do this. It's time to do. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. This guy is built like a whole chicken nugget. I'll never doubt Ziggy again. Oh my god, really? Did you... Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Did you know video? Did you know you can't craft Spellbinding Circle in Master Duel? That's gonna be my next TikTok. Ooh, not a good hand. Not a great hand. Thunder, he runs... Th but he doesn't have an extra deck. Wait, what? But he doesn't have an extra deck. Why did he do that? Time Wizard Normal Summon first turn. That is menacing. 
That's the most menacing thing I've ever seen. Well done, Ziggy. Well done. Give me ideas for free TikToks. Look at you. Is this loud enough, chat? Can you hear it? Probably shouldn't be asking that about almost two hours in. His entire goddamn body is a chicken nugget? Yeah, and he's got like... He, he, he's built in 360p, dude. It's not good. <laughs> this text is a solo quality. Ooh, look what that got there. Don't remind junk of chicken nuggets. Oh. I haven't eaten a chicken nugget since that stream. You guys know that, right? Yo, no way, chat. It's painful toys. Choose five cards for the deck. Uh, all right. I choose you. I choose you. I choose. What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? I'll choose calculator. Dude, these are all good. No matter what he says to the graveyard, I'm going to be able to reborn it. So I'll choose you and hmm. give me, give me goblin. Would you mind goblin chat? Oh, okay, cool. That's, that's perfect actually. Oh my God. This guy's an idiot chat. Watch this. Seal crushed. It's time to crush your seal. And now I can tribute summon Grand Marg, the Rock Monarch! Woo! Oh, spell shattering arrow? Now guess what, chat? I can premature burial to bring out... Okay, if I bring out Mahavelo, he's gonna get 2,000 attack points. He gives 300 for each. And that's a level five monster times 300. 15 times three more is 2100. So this is a better value. 2400, even higher. Look at that. One calculator and grand marks, 2400 already. God, I'm such a good duelist. Yeah, they got little sprites and everything salty. It's amazing. Not only that, when they attack, they got specific animations for attacking. Uh, they get back sprites. You get you customize your own character and you're a character in the game with a story mode. You get star chests for a new dual disc. You can edit your hair. You get your own little catchphrases. You can say your own words while you're dueling. You can choose your own dialogue sets. It's just, it's crazy, man. Absolutely insane what you can do in this game. And I love it. And they never made a game like this since. I mean, we're going to be playing through all three of them in the series. Like we're going to be doing a, a Stardust Stardust Accelerator, we're going to be doing, um, what you call it, chat? Stardust Accelerator, we're going to be doing Reverse of Arcadia, and then we're going to be doing the, the last one. I don't know what the last one is. Ooh. <laughs> Pretty decent card effect. Over the Nexus. Thank you. Thank you. Over the Nexus is the last one. But we're going to be going through all three, so I hope you guys stick around. Oh, you're done. Look, he even gets a whip animation. That's crazy. Yo, take that. Dude, this guy is nothing. Our deck is so strong right now. And here's the thing that's going to really suck. If we ever do any tag force or like any uh, acceleration duels, we're screwed. 4100 calculator. <laughs> we win. Let's go! Hell yeah! Hey boss, you gonna continue Persona 3? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think so. It's just trying to find time for it. Depends when I get off work this week. But yeah, I'd, I'd love to keep playing Persona 3. Not bad. Yeah, beat the shit out of you. There's no way I'm losing. Over the Nexus CPU takes a lot of time to think, though. That's true. There's a lot more cards in that game. But hey, over the Nexus, I think it's 2011. And I think they have... Uh, I, think, I think Machinas are in there. And I think Lavals exist. So we, we'll probably be using a lot of those. And we'll probably be using the same cheat to use banned cards. So, Ooh, Satellite Wall. Huh? So this guy's probably a defense-heavy deck.
Get out! Monster card! Get out! Monster card! Oh, next turn, chat. We can tribute. Take control of our opponent's monster. Tribute again. Resummon with the call bot. That is so good. Call the haunted. Wow. Hey, well. Sword and shit. Oh my god, I have zero. No! Oh my god. He totally wrecked me. I was not anticipating this. Holy moly! No! Now I can't do anything! Oh, good, 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 good. Okay. By the Elder Gods. Now we can initiate enemy controller. Take control of our opponent's monster. And now we can tribute that so many. Oh. Oh, because we normal summon. I'm an idiot. Uh, that's okay. We'll call the haunted. <laughs> I'm convinced the junk would disappear for six months. He would return with a demo for a trading card game RPG. Dude, if I had five minutes alone and an like a 30 seconds of an elevator pitch with like any executive of Konami. I would convince them to make a game uh, where you start off from, like, I've already talked about it on stream, designing my ideal, uh, ideal Yu-Gi-Oh game where the player gets control of the Millennium Hourglass, which allows them to go through different periods of time. And uh, with the use of the Millennium Hourglass, it can go to Duelist Kingdom, go through the events of Duelist Kingdom, use it to go through the events of 5Ds and just do that again and again and again and again i think that'd be insane oh no holy shit shut up the bitch oh no Ooh, wood boring and patchy good god would you have to play with the scuffed duels kingdom rules as well yes no, it'd be basic. It'd be basic Yu-Gi-Oh. But you'd be able to duel with like jobbers and get star chips and make your way through the game and like make your way to the finals with Yugi and everything. It'd be awesome. If I ever win the lottery, there will be signs, chat. I will get I will be like, hey Konami, here is five hundred million dollars if we make my game. <laughs> the biggest waste of money, but hey, that game is gonna be bussin' as shit. I'm gonna make I'm gonna make uh, Kazuki Takahashi-san proud. You know what I mean? Maybe, maybe five million, chat. Maybe like five to ten million. I'd spend on that game. Maybe not fifty million, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean? Oh, look! It's Tristan Taylor, the acrobatic monkey. Sorry, but we could only consider five million and one yen. You had your chance. Konami! Uh, you know, they probably still wouldn't do it. For, for no reason, even if I paid for it. Oh! Gaia Power! Gaia Power is actually good. We, we only have Earth cards for the most part. Oh! 3 6 guy. Girl, you find get low. Did I miss my replay yet? What do you mean replay? What what, you, what does it look like we're playing, my gamer? What does it look like we're playing, my gamer? Master Duel sure looks weird today, chat. I don't know. Master Duel's looking a little weird. Oh no, Needleworm? A staple of any mill deck. You know what I mean? Boom, 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 boom. Attack Grand Marge and end this pathetic duelist life. Let's go, GG! God, I'm good at this game, Chad. I thought this was going to be a hard game, but no, it's relatively easy. Let's go! What? No way! Looks like the duel's over.
I know. There's this shack just up ahead. Want to go? What the fuck? Is this your room? Here it is. Come on in, junk. You know I'm a stranger, right? Have you ever thought about the fact that Malevolent Lester is basically giving uh, any monster a green monster girlfriend? I haven't, but that's a really good point. I, what even is that equip spell, you know? Don't touch the computer and you're right. There's important data on it. The, the really funny thing is you cannot progress until you touch this computer. Computer is on, but it's password protected. Hey, come on. I said not to touch it. I mean it. Okay. Don't touch the computer. No, this is a dude. Rally's a dude, Ariel. Hey, yo. Huh? You say come back. Let's step outside for a minute. Okay. Yo, chat. Look at it. It's you. It's you say. Welcome back. You say. Hey, who's that? So this is junk. There's something odd about junk, but not in a bad way. I brought junk here to become one of our friends and now everyone's fine with it. You know, junk's also a duelist. I see. I'm going to take another ride. He obviously does not like us. I see. I'm taking another ride. Bye. A strong jolt of lightning run through your head. A fragment of your memory has returned. <gasps> what? I had a house? <gasps> I had my own room. Turbo Duel. Duel Runner. Speed Counter. Ooh, is that my Duel Runner? You say hi. Hi. John Thornton, welcome in. Spell card. Activate. <laughs> oh, my head! Ah. <gasps> hey! You okay, Junk? What happened? Remember anything? Junk checked his dual disc and a card appeared from the inside. Ooh! A speed spell! Oh, that's a speed spell card! Wow! Still his archetype name. <laughs> he doesn't like me at all. <laughs> You speak to Rally about something you remembered. Is there a password in the game like putting codes from U-Guards into the game? I think so. Look, maybe you're a turbo duelist. If you want to know about dual runners, you should talk to Yusei. He's a turbo duelist after all. I thought Yusei was coming here, but he isn't, eh? I could have sworn I had inside of a dual runner. <gasps> oh, hey, what's that? You have a speed spell card? How do you ever get such a thing? Say Nervin, if Junk is a speed spell card, then maybe your new pal's a turbo duelist too. Well, one card doesn't exactly prove it, but it does make it pretty likely. When you think about it, it's kind of random being someone with a speed spell card. Now, if Junk had a duel runner, then we'd certainly have a turbo duelist on our hands. Yeah, I see what you mean. So, Junk, do you remember what your duel runner is? Oh, I see. You don't know, huh? Means it really is a downer. But hey, aren't only the double dual strategy either you say or security? Hmm, wait a sec. Doesn't that mean Junkie just comes from the city? Oh yeah, that's gotta be right. But maybe you can go to the city and then you should go away. That's gonna require a dual runner, so rally. You let's help Junk go look for one. Oh, good idea. If everyone pitches in, then we can sure find one in no time. These guys are really nice. I show up, and they're like, let's find this guy a motorcycle. Let's get him to the city. Let's get him out of here. A few days later. Let's save. Gotta save. Junk doing the Kua Bar voice. Yeah, let's go everybody. Speed world. The spell card activates. Let's continue, all right? Pretty sure there is a password system. Let's check it out. Oh, okay. There is a password system, chat. Um, someone want to give me, someone want to give me a code? Someone want to give me a code, chat? For a Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster. Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster. Yes.
You're a messy. Liar be up so bad that not even kittens will look at you. Uh, give me a random code. Don't tell me what it is until I put it in, though. Spirit gun! One, eight, one, four, four, five, zero. The card is either not in the list or not available. Five, three, seven, one, four, zero, zero, nine. The card is either not available or not in the list. I think it's a card I have to already own. Oh, maybe, yeah, maybe they're already banned, you know? Three, eight, six, nine, nine, eight, five, four. Oh, sorry. Fuck. You missed the three. Damn it. Three, eight, six, nine, nine, eight, five, four. Nope. Oh my God. I found out why. Why is that? Six, eight, six, five, eight, seven, two, eight. Why is that? Why is, why is it not able to use codes? What's going on? You have to already own the card or something? Damn. You have to have 80% of the pack the intended card comes from. What? Are you serious? You're kidding me. Oh my God, that's crazy. Okay. I mean, that's the way, that's, I get why they did that. So you can't just like get all the cards you want immediately and pull out of the game. I, I understand. But it is very dumb. No runners are great. I'm gonna get one. You better about your memory. You should look for your door runner. <laughs> hey, hey, Jug! It's meant to uh, it's meant to edge out getting the missing cards before buying this, uh, out of the same pack. Uh, so we can we each reveal what we're trying to get, Junk? Yeah, absolutely. Go for it. Pack Force wouldn't do us dirty like this. Absolutely not, but you'd have to rent the card. I have one that's in the game, though. Oh, he has to actually own the card. Yeah, yeah. Book of Book of Taiyu. Ooh. I must Harpy's Feather Dust. That would have been good. Hey, Junk! I found someone who's looking to sell a dual runner! And better yet, I think they'll partner for the little, really low price. Isn't that great? I was going to give you the Flame Bell Synchro. Oh, it worked quite. No! Life service. Oh, Doombox, that would have been great. Just come with me. Hurry up. Do I even have the money for this? I brought somebody who wants a door runner. You, huh? You want a door runner? Of course, it's not free, but I can give you two for a thousand DP. How about it? I only have 834. Insufficient DP. Well, there's enough DP. Go duel some and get some DP and then come back. Sure, yeah, buy it with he's in the mood to sell. I suggested Little Chimera. That would have been great as well. I love Little Chimera. Reminds me of my late dog. Even though I know it's like a cat. Well, whatever. But my dog was white and so was Little Chimera, so. Um, let's duel this guy. This guy looks like a jobber. You bet, I'll take you on in a duel or any other challenge. I'm sure this will be a legit exchange of business. What do you mean? What do you mean? I don't like the way you said that. Yeah, I don't like the way you said that. Dude, start up. I'm pretty sure I can take this guy on. Not a problem. What do you got? What do you got? What kind of cards you got? Show me your cards! Got her. I don't like that. That's sus. Get rid of one of your cards! Uh, let's get rid of it! 
Ooh, Egyptian vacation, huh? I don't know what that means. But I'm gonna kick your ass. This door runner's for sale. Really good deal. We found it in some head honcho's garage after he disappeared. Yeah, it's got fire markings all over it because it's like a fire deck or something. <laughs> Woo! Take that, loser! Kind of. I really hope Hunter paces in this game. You visit the parts of Egypt no one talks about, AKA green. <laughs> I want to go to Egypt just cause you know, I'm a huge Yu-Gi-Oh fan. Like this seems like a, the dumbest reason to go to Egypt, <laughs> but I'd love to go. I'm also a huge Jojo fan. So like the overlap right there is so huge. <laughs> I want to see where the fuck they beat Dio up at. Uh, half of Junk's 5D Splash is just people stealing his stuff and selling it back to him. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, I want to see if Hunter Pace is like in the game aside from that one duel at the beginning. Yeah, I'd love to go to Egypt. I actually really want to go there. Take a picture of Flame Cerberus, you know? What is he doing? Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this, but we're, <laughs> we're gonna stop the Des Lacunda from attacking. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my God. Okay, at least we can summon the creator now. Are you ready, chat? I tribute two of my monsters to summon. The creator! The creator's effect activates! I send one card from my grave, my hand to the grave to summon out a card from my graveyard. And then I attack, yeah! Attack Lakunda, or Lakuda, whatever his name is. Good thing about this is I can keep summoning out monsters so long as I got one card in my hand. I end my turn. Egypt already profits from tourism with the ancient stuff. Going there for Yu-Gi-Oh probably doesn't a uh, different isn't different from them. I don't know, man. I I just want to be taken advantage of. Ooh, I'm a very uh, nice person. People could probably shake me down for a lot of money for no reason. I have watched videos where um, there are people who walk around with whistles that don't actually work at the pyramids and they'll try to like stop you and act like they're an official person working at the pyramids to get you to pay a fine or something. Crazy. What the fuck did you just say? You tribute set? I don't like that. I don't like that, Chad. I don't like that. I don't like goblin. What are you buying? No way! Change of heart busted! Give me that face down tribute monster. Give me that card. Uh yeah! Woo! <laughs> no! Goblin, Otsukeki Bodai. Bodai. My hubris. Yeah, I should have just gone for the attack. But I knew he had that damn face down card. I wonder how Egyptians play Yu Gi Oh! Do you think there's any Egyptian Yu Gi Oh! players? All three of them? Do you think there's Yu Gi Oh! players out there? Probably play them with stone tablets, right? <laughs> like the big heavy stone tablets. They probably sacrifice people for tributes to summon the big powerful monsters. <laughs> All kinds of stuff like that. 
Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Time to win. Ooh, yeah. I draw. Ooh, yeah. This guy's never going to play a face-up monster, so this is kind of useless to us right now. I would love to meet an Egyptian person that plays Yu-Gi-Oh. I wouldn't be able to understand any word they're saying, but I'd love to talk to them. Hmm. You think people play Yu-Gi-Oh? What, what's one country you people think aren't playing Yu-Gi-Oh? Are you serious? Call aside! Absolutely. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh yeah. I'm gonna say a swear word at YCS and get you banned. Oh yeah. I'm thinking Austria? North Korea? <laughs> Hey guys, time for YCS North Korea. <laughs> Holy shit. It'll be a lot more than banned if you swear at YCS North Korea. <laughs> oh my God. You're not leaving North Korea alive if you swear. There was a competitive player from Egypt had to take anger management because people kept annoying him, calling him the Pharaoh. Are you serious? Dude, I'd be pissed off too if people made fun of my heritage. Dude, I would I would definitely be the one to call him the Pharaoh. <laughs> Nabanaki Pharaoh. Dude, I would rock that. Like a professional Yu-Gi-Oh player? Like, that's your moniker? You could just call yourself the Pharaoh? That's so cool. But I mean, it might be sacrilegious or whatever. Dude, he refuses to go down. Ow! Okay, fine. I'm sorry, King of Ambles. Might be sacrilegious, but it's still fucking cool. Early mid 2000s. Ooh. <gasps> Confiscation! I'm gonna go ahead and put that back in the graveyard. <laughs> I love you, girl! Love this stupid kooky game, Chad. He tried to play giant trunate on me? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. I think he's going to get a, a card effect off here, chat. Oh! Painful choice. Really goaded right now, actually. Okay, let's do this. Uh, so here's what, here's what I can do. Since I don't have a normal summon, I'm going to send a copy of Dark Valkyrie to the graveyard. Hopefully I don't... He doesn't choose it for summoning. I'm going to choose... Poon Warrior. This guy. This guy. And this guy. Oh, yes! We also have coverage about these guys. The giant shuffle deck that had thousands of cards. Dude, they shook up Yu-Gi-Oh! forever. They have a lifelong legacy now. But they've also ruined it to where we can't have more cards than 60. <laughs> so I don't know, man. Good and bad for everything, you know? But they did, they did set an example. Yes, Dark Valkyria! Affect the Hudson up! Do Egyptians still use stone tablets? How drunk got <laughs> canceled. Oh, this son of a bitch. Did you see this guy? I'm so pissed. Good tidings, DJ Zombie. How's it going? Not much. We uh, just started our journey. We're about to buy a dual runner from a completely reputable source as soon as we beat this loser here. No! Son of the bitch! Defense troll! Wow, he just drew the out conveniently. Isn't that so convenient, chat? Wow, how did he do that? I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have some. I'll watch some Arc Five. Have fun. Oh yeah, absolutely, man. You just coming in to check up for five minutes and peace out. <laughs> I see. Uh, I haven't watched Arc Five yet, but I heard it's really good. So enjoy. This guy over here. This guy over here, this is how you support your favorite streamer? Please don't, please don't answer that question. Please don't say anything about you not being my favorite or 
me not being your favorite streamer. Oh, this card's busted because he can flip it back down and flip it back up again. No! No! Oh! Ow! Oh! Ow! Oh! Ow! Oh! Torch down! Thank you for the tier one sub to Lady Logan. Lady Logan, welcome back to the Shade Brigade! Yeah, thank you so much, Short Style. Thank you for being our third uh, sub of the day. Really appreciate that. You might hear our sub goal today. And if we do, we'll go on for an additional hour of dueling. You guys earn the extra duels, of course. Ooh, we have 1850. We can get over that easily, actually. Yeah, Lady Logan, they know that you're a fan of the channel, so they want to support you. Short Style, really appreciate the support. I'm sorry. But hi to you all. You're sorry. Uh, I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. How was your day? Were you having a good day? Playing some Yu-Gi-Oh! How good for? Indo turn. Main of it. Ooh, Canyon. That's a good card. Too bad it doesn't add defense to any of the defense position monsters. I've always wanted to make a deck that like has really high defense rock monsters that deal double damage when you attack them and then like buff up their defense as high as you can, you know? Especially with Unity. I've always wanted to run something like that if I could do it. I was about to go on to say you, my Kami Oshi. Oh, I'm your god, Oshi. <laughs> it's so nice. What the fuck? I'm glad. I'm glad that I can fit your weird niche. I appreciate that. I hope you continue supporting me, even if I were, am to change appearances in the near future. Wink, wink. I win! Now give me my money. I need to buy a dual runner. I only did this to buy a dual runner. No, we, we honestly have not lost a duel yet. Yeah, grovel before me. How'd you like that? I lost on purpose. Dude, you're me. Oh man, I feel you, man. I was supposed to telework yesterday, but my internet was having issues connecting to my my uh, my work's teleworking program. So I ended up just having to go into work and I was like, you know, fuck it, I'm taking Friday off. We got Friday off. I'm pretty excited about that. Jack is trying to get in a swimsuit edition calendar. Absolutely. You guys fund it. I'll, I'll definitely buy it. All right, let's buy it. So what do you do about the dual run? I'm willing to part with it for a thousand DP. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, that wraps up a deal. You just made yourself one fine purchase. Hey, since I'm a really good mood today, I'll even throw in an extra special bonus for you. Uh, roost it up in the subway, right? I'll just deliver the dual runner for you. So wait a bit. Well then, things turned out pretty good, right? Now you're gonna get your own dual runner. So trust me on this one. Let's just have him delivered to the subway right away. Head back there first. I'll be going back a little later. Damn. Damn. Oh, what there like two duelists around here? I guess they're not here anymore. Locked. Seems to be no way in. Here, I'll change my batteries real quick, chat. What kind of swimsuits? Uh, the ones that Borat wears, the really long ones. The really long one that barely covers the crotch, but it goes all the way up to his shoulders. That one. That's the kind of swimsuit that I want to rock. Called a banana hammock. There you go. Banana hammock. Mankini. Yep. Cowkini. Cowkini. Time to get my own dual runner. Ooh, look at that, Chad. I think I can actually change the color of it. What? I'm the pack. Hmm. Nope. Not yet. Not yet. Hmm. Hmm. Damn. No, 
unfamiliar duel runner has been placed before you. Could this be the vehicle you bought earlier? Mm -hmm. What's this? This duel runner, there's something very odd about it. Hey guys, is a duel runner or idea? It looks cool as shit. Oh, nice. Ah, it's here. Let's have a look. Found codes that isn't just cards. Here's one you can try out. Isn't just cards. What do you mean by that? Looks like it's got a pretty standard frame. Must be from a fairly recent model year, and it looks pretty sharp. Some adjustments have been made, too. I'll bet you'll get some real speed out of this thing. Oh, uh... No way. What the... There's no engine. What? And there's no CPU! A tool runner's body is worth nothing by itself. I was gonna run! Rats, we got hosed! Sorry, Junk, I'm really sorry. Wow. We just got fucking ripped off in downtown Detroit. Completely all my fault! All because I was actually trusting that dirtbag. All that low life, imagine trying to pass off an utter, such utter junk. I'm gonna go go up there and speak my mind damn scam that's crazy in satellite no way can i do that now can i mm. where do i uh change my dual runner color i don't want it to be blue mm. i don't want a blue dual runner can i change it All right, someone said they found a code that's not just cards. Is this a, is this a code that you put in the password machine? Oh, I don't want to, I don't want to do that. That might break the game. Never mind. Wait till you get it operational. Okay, we'll keep going then. I can't believe I got fucking scammed day one. Hey, you piece of shit. You fucking ripped us off. I'm gonna kick your ass. Go down be here. You can't be swearing here at the event. Ah! <laughs> Blitz has been kidnapped. You have to quickly go and save him. Did the ancient Egyptians play Yu-Gi-Oh? <laughs> God, I wish. Door's locked. You can't get inside. You need to help us right away. Explain the situation to your friends. Wow. Oh, hey, Junk. What's going on? Blitz, what's all of a sudden? Uh, what's that now? What? This business guy at the square is one of the thugs. Oh, no was messing with him? That's no good at all. Junk, you sure? Come on. I'll tell everyone. Ed, be careful, chat. Can't say swears, okay? Oh, no, we better help right away. There's Blitz thinking. So what do you do now? You can be help of only you over here. I'm a duelist. Come on, you guys are going to do something. And help Blitz ASAP. You mean you don't care what happens to him? Oh, uh, okay. Okay, do I just have to wait for you say to get back or something or? Oh, I'm the trash man. I go into the ring and I start playing scrap monsters. Is there anything around here? Or... Ooh, a lot of broken glass. You should clean that up. Oh, <gasps> oh what? 450 bucks? Let's go. I gotta start looking around more often, chat. Holy moly. Also, why is there that much glass around where the duel runner is? Oh, there's two new duelists. Okay. Let's not do this. What? You've come to great duel? Didn't I give you the duel runner? Ah, uh, that guy. No, I don't know him. If you beat me, I'll uh, tell you. What'll it be? I'll duel you. 
pretty sure yourself, eh? Bet you're bluffing. Kick his ass, chat. Oh my god, that face is ugly. Sorry, that was mean. <laughs> the face is not pretty. Hmm. <laughs> I think we have to kill this guy, Junk. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Oh, man. I think we're gonna have to fucking murder this guy. Oh. Please don't beat me. No! No, 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 no! Oh, shit. Well, as you can see, chat. Oh my god, no! 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 My God, I'm not OTK'd. I'm not out of it yet, but holy moly, am I about to be? our first L. I don't think we can win this one, Chad. I think this guy's gonna kill us. Sonic Chick's the only reason we're not dead already. What the fuck? If you have two or more spellcasters, one of them attack becomes 3,000? Oh my god! The deck named Masterful Magicians, it was bound to be some chicanery. Dude, I'm getting my ass kicked by this chicanery. Look at this guy. Oh, well, at least I can activate Mecha Bunny in the graveyard. Let's go! Nano Machine Son. Nano Machine Son, that's right. Why aren't you attacking? Interesting. I need a, I need a tribute monster real bad. Ooh, honestly? If I, oh, if I bring him back, he'll have enough attack points to destroy one of the, mo the monsters here. Or... And then four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine times 300, chat. Nine, 18, 27. Exactly. Okay, we might be able to, we might be able to do this. We might be able to do this. If he does not have any way to stop my combo, we might be able to do this. Woo! <laughs> Are you ready, kids? Mecha buddy! And then I play the calculator! Time to battle! Attack! No! What? No! Okay, chat, I need you to pick for me. All right, check. Which one is it gonna be? Which one is it gonna be, chat? Which one of these is it gonna be? Oh my god. 
middle? Oh. Good duelist choose left. You're right. I am a bad duelist. Oh no! Hmm. Well, regardless, we gotta get rid of this Dark Magician girl. So. Should have chosen left. I'm not a good duelist! All right, well, that's all we can do. I, uh, end of my turno. Damn. Okay, man, we get it. You got, you got her, okay? You were right? It was middle, damn it! Would it be crazy if you set like ancient gear town or something like that? When, when you did those magical hats, you just summon out two ancient gear monsters immediately. Okay, okay, okay. Now we can win. Let's do it! <laughs> Time to go goblin mode. Attack Mahavelo! Ooh, take that 50 damage. Take this 800 damage from Mecha Buddy. <laughs> you knew good duelist choose left. He was one step ahead using y uh, Yugi Riz for the magical hat. Dude, Yugi always gets by by some random bullshit. I love it. We have a Radiant Mirror Force too, look at that. Ooh. Nice, if he tries to summon a bunch of monsters on, on us, we could just pop those bitches back in the deck. Oh, it's over, it's Jover. That was a hard fought duel. That was one of the hardest duels we've had so far. Is it gonna be harder from here on out? Holy crap, man. Attack the moon! Was an official strategy at the TCT? <laughs> Dude, back in the day when the first sets of Yu-Gi-Oh! came out, I think the best card you could possibly play was like Silver Wolf or Silver Fang was the best card. At 1,200 attack points, that was the best card you could play. So I don't think strategy meant a lot back then. All right, we're making our money back from that dual runner, at least. Uh, this, this isn't my day. Your friends are in the building. Friends? Should take a crack at that second pack before we go in. Okay. Might as well strengthen the deck a little bit, because we definitely might need it. Yeah. We definitely will need that power card. So we're banging a hot stuff with Totsumi Giant with the very strongest, the very, very first iteration of the OCG, I think. Yeah, isn't that fucking wild? How not fun the OCG used to be? Like the first set of rules where you could just play any monster you wanted. Okay, okay. What? No way. Is this what I think it is? Arm Dragon level three? Or is the Black Blade Dragon level six? Yo! Ultimate Baseball Kid! Greed? Every time a player draws because of a card effect, they take 500 damage each, during each in phase for each card they drew by that card effect. Got the maxi counter, you know what I mean? Right, give me level six and I'll actually play him. Master of Odds! I play my totally licious Master of Odds! Masked Dragon, that's pretty good. Now, if I had uh, any of the Armed Dragons or or um, this guy, well, he's, he's more than 1,500, but... We're getting all the level cards, it seems, okay. 
another masked dragon. We have two floating masked dragons. It might honestly be worth running just to have two masked dragons. What do you guys think? Because that's tribute fodder. That's 1,400 attack points. I might just run that. Okay. Yeah, everything else is kind of mid. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to run in two masked dragons. Damn, thanks for telling me about that, man. Wow. I'm definitely going to have some grinding to do uh, after the stream. The only reason I really run those mecha bunnies is for floating anyway. So now that I have two masked dragons, I really don't need two weaker floaters when I could have two stronger floaters. Masked dragon starts with an M. Is it Masked Dragon or am I thinking of a different name? Okay, thank God. All right. Let's save and go save our friend. The one who got us scammed. I'm do I can't even begin to know which duelist I'm gonna have to duel to grind. Cause I think once you duel against duelist a certain time, number of times in this game, you're going to have to actually take them on in the world championship screen. And you're going to have to duel them at least five more times. I, I can't remember if it's five or ten times. But it's, it's a ludicrous amount. Something really large like that. And then you're going to have to beat them that many times for the CPU. And then, then you unlock a card pack. So it's pretty tough to get new cards in this game. But I kind of like grinds in video games. So it works out for me. <gasps> money? Oh, let's go. More money. We love money here. We love it. Hello? Hey, you how are you kidding? Zach Turf, get out! We don't get out, I'll beat you up in a duel. Kick your ass, dude. I gotta regret this later. I'm gonna kick this guy's ass, chat! Let's go! This guy isn't harder than the last guy. Last guy was a pain in the ass. I like his outfit. I like his style. I'm not gonna lie. The all purple? Love it, dude. I love your jacket. I, I kind of want to wear it. I kind of want to steal it. Hmm. I don't really want to steal that jacket. Rock Monarch! Let's go! Woo! Oh my god! Sword style! Is he playing monarchs? Here's a tree worm frog. Sword style! Thank you for the tier one for 28 months, my gamer! Welcome back! The Shade Brigade! Welcome in! Thank you so much! That's our fourth sub of the day. Thank you so much for contributing to our daily sub goal. I'm trying to stay above 100 so I can get the 60-40 split. Ooh, confiscation. Not gonna really, it's, this is just card advantage because you can see the cards in their hand and you can take one and send it to the graveyard. Oh my God. Oh, he's got a bunch of dragons, like really powerful dragons too. I think we're gonna get rid of soul exchange. Well, you see, I don't really need soul exchange. Yo, sword style! Ah! Ah! Sword style, think we can think of tier one sub to Seal XXX47! Seal, welcome to the Shade Brigade, courtesy of Sword Styles! Let's go! Thanks, man! Look at you going ham today! Much appreciated, my friend. Now let's rock. Attack Dog Bacteria! Oh no! Bernardo! Welcome in, Bernardo! How's it going, man? We're just dueling it up over here. It's a really good fun time.
Oh, shit. I knew this was coming. He's gonna attack my Dark Valkyria, and then I'm just gonna attack him when he's face down in defense position. It's gotta be really easy to sweep the floor with this guy. He's got a really satisfying haircut. I've never seen anyone with a mohawk as defined as any character in any anime. Ooh, Mass Dragon, perfect. That way if he destroys it, I still get another Mass Dragon. You know what? Let's actually be a painful choice. Let's actually be a painful choice here, chat. Um. Oh, you know what? Yeah, give me that. Give me that one. Oh my God, so many good cards here. Every card I would love to have in the hand that would solve an immediate problem. Oh yeah, every card that I'm gonna get is gonna solve an immediate problem. Which one do you wanna give me? Change of heart? Are you serious? Woo, resub. Yeah, let's go, Pit Queen. Dude, Painful Choice is such a good card. Holy shit. We win! We simply win! Not the much been looking over for cards and apparently found about the Magic the Gathering is gonna have a Fallout crossover. Dude, they're they're going ham with their crossover events. I hope Yu-Gi-Oh doesn't get any ideas and do like a Disney crossover or some weird shit, you know? Let's go! We kicked their fucking ass, Jack! Oh my, chat, chat, can you please read his voice line right there? His little chat, oh my God, could you please read what he just said to us right now? How the deck did I lose to you? Are you, dude, you gotta be decking kidding me right now with these stupid ass puns. <laughs> Old Yu-Gi-Oh gets away with too much bullshit and this is one of those things. <laughs> Holy shit. I love this game. A guy wearing glasses? You a friend of yours? Yeah, he might have been here. Yeah. This computer looks broken. Oh, conveniently placed chairs to not. Oh! Card? Money? <gasps> I can't believe I'm saying this, but rush recklessly going in the deck. Not bad. 700 attack points. Hard to get over. Not bad. Oh, the deck that I lose to you. What the deck, chat? What the deck? I'm gonna say that to someone in real life. The deck is wrong with you. You're a few cards short of a full Yu-Gi-Oh deck, my friend. You got 39 cards. I thought it was noisy, so that was you. What's that, your friend? Yeah, he's in the bag storage, but you're not getting past me. If you want to get through, you got to beat me in a duel. God damn, dude. I'm not going to let you win so easily. I'm adding this to my cringe compilation. Bring it on, fool. <laughs> Woo! Lucky turtle shell. Oh, please tell me you're all defense and I'm all attack and I'm just going to destroy you. I like the music in this game. Oh, change of heart. Turn one. That's really good. Oh, and I have Prime Material Dragon. I can just tribute next turn. Oh, the deck that I lose to you. We're trying to be friendly, uh, a family friendly show with the American version having finger guns. <laughs> it's not about the size of the deck. It's how you use it, chat. I negate this. I cannot. Oh, hi, Mark. Yep, this guy is definitely turtling. Oh my God, I hate him so much. He played stumbling, chat. Chat, I can't believe it. I simply can't believe it. He's playing stumbling. Okay. Give me your monster. Change of heart. I take control of your monster. Turn all monster cards with respect to field and shuffle them. You and your opponent pick up cards until you both have the same number of monsters that will return to the deck. I should summon the level four or level lower monsters in the face damage defense position. The rest of the cards are discarded to the graveyard. Okay, let's do it. 
I'm okay with that. I get two free summon monsters? That's all right. Woo! Oh, wait. Oh, he gets one too. I thought I was going to get both. No. I end my turn. I do love this stupid game though, dude. More person. That's his ace card? Wait, can you set any card you want to your ace to do these cool effects and stuff? Dude, I want that so badly, please. That is so cool. Holy shit, I just mailed five cards. No! He can't keep getting away with this! He can't keep getting away with this! Hey, get rid of your hand for me, okay? Go ahead and discard your entire head! You loser! Alright, thanks, buddy. Oh my god. Oh, I don't like this chat. I don't like this guy. I... I guess I'm just gonna summon. Oh my God, chat. I'm so angry right now. Look at this. I hate stall decks, especially in early Yu-Gi-Oh because there's not very much forms of removal. You can't really do anything against a lot of these early versions of decks that do this kind of stuff. You're just kind of stuck with what you got, you know? Oh God. That's a uh, compulse. Oh God. Put that back in your hand. It's my turn. I draw. Oh my God. Oh, oh, oh. Get rid of that. And this is why empty jar and jar based lava golem decks were good. Yep. Stall was great back in the day, wasn't it? Old school. Dude, I remember when this game came out. I was in high school. Isn't that crazy. Actually, I was in junior high, end of junior high. This would have came along perfectly if I was playing it at the same time. I didn't get into Yu-Gi-Oh until like my junior and senior year of high school. Yeah, you could tell it was really cool. I actually went to both proms and I had dates for each one. So that's how cool I am, chat. I actually went to prom. And my turn. Right. I'm gonna destroy this little twink. This twonk? What's the difference between a twink and a twonk? Mother. He's got two of them. He's got two of them, chat. He's got two of them. God damn it! No! No, don't do this! No! I can't believe you did this! At least he didn't get a card himself, you know? Am I promised someone danced to bird is a word? Probably not you, did send back the deck member. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that was me, I forgot. I compulsed it. You better not play another one of these yeah, damn things, dude. I'm gonna be pissed. Ooh, give me the calculator. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Sadly, but so true. Stop crying like a baby junk. Hey. Sadly, but true. So stop to cry like baby junk. Okay, I will stop to cry like baby junk. My bad. I did not mean to cry like baby junk. Ooh. 900 attack points, baby. 11 years ago? God oh, damn. Well, mine was 10 years ago. We're about the same age. All right, now the calculator should have a tons of attack. Oh my God! Oh, I hate this guy. Ooh, I hate him. Ooh, I hate him. Ooh, I hate him so much, Chad. I hate him so much. Ooh, I don't like this guy. <sighs> 
two years older than you. Yep. I just turned 20 years old. I am 20 years of old. Let's call this deck the middle finger deck. Well, it's not very good. Like there's no win condition here. So he's not really doing damage unless the condition is just a mill. Which I told if it's to mill, then yeah, totally. You, you're going to do some good stuff. Oh, this calculator isn't connected to Call of the Haunted. Silver lining. Uh, we also have a Call of the Haunted permanently stuck on the field. Oh, oh, oh my God. That. Oh my God, I'm pissed off right now. Oh, oh my God. I'm so angry right now. This guy, this dude, man. <sighs> Old school Yu-Gi-Oh was so much fun. So much interaction. Stumbling. Gravity bide. Not being able to attack if you're level four or higher. Level limit area B. Oh! Right now, the calculator is kind of my out to a lot of these things because it's three star. But nothing else can attack but him. Oh. When God closes a window or opens up a door, you know what I mean? Area B has got me a lot of wins. Oh, yeah. Like, me too. I, I, I bought the um, fire structure deck back in the day. Oh my god, are you serious? This, this guy? The Dual Link's meta pick? I get to draw three cards. All the spells go to the graveyard. So he just gave me one free card. All right, I end my turn. Okay, he's got one turn left, chat. One turn left before I start turning him into fucking mincemeat. That's why I love Tingu format. A lot of uh, outs to back row and removal for these type of shenanigans. Yeah, we'll get to 2011 eventually. Trust me. This is pretty much Edison Turbo. If you really want to look at it that way, you know? I will play my last mass dragon, which uh, gives me a lot of attack points from my calculator. 4,800 to be exact. All right, time to attack. Oh, my mess dragon. Oh my God, Maple. Maple! My main inspo for giving this game a try again. Uh, welcome in. Yeah, this guy is a complete dickhole. Look at him. Look at him make me draw three cards for free. This guy's strategy is unbeatable. Uh, Maple, I loved your sous ship tweet. It was so hilarious. Uh, are you going to do a hungry burger next? I would love to see you do like a decorative hungry burger. Please. Please, bestie, I will sponsor you. I'll pay for the materials, but please make a hungry burger. Kingu format's pretty fun, though. Yeah, uh, as a... <laughs> I don't know if you knew this, chat, but I'm... I'm actually... <laughs> I'm actually a Edison Relay champion of the Friendship Cup hosted by Maple and Hasher Brown. I'm pretty much... The bee's freaking knees when it comes to dueling. Yeah, I won first place. I'm the champ. That's right. I'm like Bandit Keith. I'm the former world champ. That's my only claim to fame. <laughs> you compulsing me, bro? Don't compulse me! Oh my god, this f***ing dude, he's compulsing me. Stop being a good duelist. Oh my god. I hate when the duelists are good, chat. Oh, he's still losing, though. Still losing, though. He still takes this. He set ultimate offering like a champ. Not only that, I did summon my Cyber Phoenix to get destroyed for that, you know? I activate Kudama Chain because you deserve this extra damage. You jerk. I get another card because you deserve all the extra damage, you jerk. Boom! <laughs> Take that, loser! You stupid turtle! Oh my god, get this guy out of my face. 
Yeah. A tig. That taste in my mouth. I do like his drip, though. I want that outfit. Yo, we just made all our money back from that bogus uh, dual runner that we bought. Sweet. I wonder how much an engine and a CPU is going to cost. Blessed, I've got no luck. Better get the luck out of here, man. Yo, container puzzles? Okay, is it? Uh, let's see if I'm stupid enough to mess this up somehow. <laughs> um, junk with the mohawk. No, I like his outfit, not his hair. Hmm. Oh, this really is just as simple as it seems. I'm overthinking it. It's a puzzle made for like eight-year-olds, chat. I'm pretty sure I got this. I almost messed it up. <laughs> this one brings back non... Nonny, nonary games memory. I don't know what that means. What does nonary mean? Oh, dude, he's dead. Oh, free, free stuff though. Quillboat Hedgehog. Sweet. Nice. Come on in, man. Ugh. Zero Redux. I'm doing great now that you're here. What's going on? My one of my Oshis Maple popped in for a little bit, so I was really excited. That fired me up. Junk, you came to help? Sorry about the dual runner. I know it was my fault and everything. Everyone's probably worried, so I better get back. Thanks a lot, Junk. Beats gravity bind. <laughs> the anti-gravity bind meta. Whoa. Good thing is, chat, we have a lot of money to buy cards. I think I'm going to buy more of that, uh... Sacred Phoenix of Nephestus deck. Those card packs, you know? If we can get the level, if we can get two level fours and level six, I'll consider that already worth it. Super good. That spell negation this early on. Well, that's if we get the level 10 or the level eight. I already feel better for this cold. Hell yeah. A lot of people, that's weird. A lot of people I've known, uh, I like work and stuff are also getting sick too. But I wonder if that's just like a, a nationwide bug. You are in America, right? Dunk, I heard the news from Blitz. That bird is crazy good in the Fire King decks. I'd believe it. Blitz, I was worried. Uh huh, I'm sorry, Rally. Don't get anything dangerous again. Okay, sorry. I've got to see Blitz, see the Blitz's injuries. I'll see you later, Junk. Festus is just Heavy Storm on legs. It's pretty good, not gonna lie. Ever since watching Dr. Crafty streams, I can't stop hearing Mermaid Man's Buy more cards! <laughs> Did you find Blitz? Did you find Blitz? Blitz and Chips? Oh really? So Blitz came out in One Piece? <gasps> the One Piece! The One Piece is real! <laughs> Let's go! Can we get Machaya? So anyhow, how do you rescue him? There had to be some dog standing on guard, right? I won every duel. You went and beat all those dogs by yourself? Right, I'm good. Whoa, that's amazing. What a shocker. Imagine going up against all those dogs. Who the fuck are you? What's up? Did something happen? Well, you see, to help Junk, we all went out looking for a bull runner. Then Blitz found a guy willing to sell one on the cheap. So we bought it right away. But that dual runner ended up not being a piece of junk. It didn't even have an engine or a CPU. Because they sold him a complete lemon, Blitz got really peeved. He stormed to make out a complaint. Can't wait to hear your Kariba line. Oh yeah, I gotta record him something, I forgot. <laughs> it's probably gonna be like, Hey yo, I'm fucking Karibo over here. Or like, some crazy like that, you know? Uh, but that junk dealer turned out to be a real bad guy. He was actually a member of the gang of tugs. So as it turns out, Blitz got himself captured instead. 
But then Junk would save him and Blitz returned home safely. Thanks. Thanks, Junk. You're welcome, you, you say. Wow, you say told me thanks. Isn't that crazy, chat? I'm gonna check on Blitz. Oh, uh, I'll go too. They're leaving me alone with him? Oh, God. Hey, Junk, can you wait here a minute? Oh, God! What's going on? Put those square hands away. Here, take this. It's a dual runner engine. It's mine from a long time ago, but it still works. Consider this a thank you for helping out one of my friends. It's all yours, so please take it. Maybe you should install it right away. I'm willing to give you a little advice, but really try to put it in yourself. I'll put it in, you say. Don't worry. Speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh, you open up your Battle of Legends Chapter 1 yet? No, not yet. Not yet. Hey, Jug, looks, uh, thanks for saving me so much for the skin back there. Oh, you put an engine in? Oh, uh, now it's an easy CPU. Hey, you know what? Yusei's gonna be heading out for the city today. Uh, why is he going there? Well, a long time ago, he had this friend of the name of Jaco One day, Jack stole one of Yusei's most important cards and uh, ran up to the city. So Yusei's gonna go back to get a dollar card from him. Well, no Yusei, though. He'll, uh, he'll be all right, right? Risking his life and limb to get arrested for one card. Can I change the color of my... Oh, I got a new pack! No, I can't change the color of my dual runner yet. What the hell, Chad? What do I do? Where do I go now? Hello? Now, oh, the dual runner's gonna say CPU. Oh yeah, the dual runner shop. I wonder if they're still open. <gasps> dual runner shop? We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we, we, I gotta go, I gotta go to... Skip it about up and bad up and bad up. Gonna have to deal with cool blue for a bit. I don't want cool blue. I want like rock and orange or something, you know? Something Machina related. See buildings of people on the other side of the rift. Hey, so how do I get to the shop? The door runner shop, hello? Where's the door runner shop at, chat? Am I blind? I sure do love Machina. It's the thing that got me to Yu-Gi-Oh. Midas Gold? Yeah. A Midas Touch, baby. Where's the Dual Runner shop? Where do I go now, chat? Do, to, do you know what? I probably have to talk to Yusei first. He's just going to the city today. You Turbo Jewels, I heard him. That's Jack Edlis. I think we have to talk to him to make him initiate the little quest and then we'll go to the next objective. Let's do a little quick save. Ah, it's junk. You heard? Yeah, I'm gonna get through the pipeline to the city. I'm gonna get my card back from Jack. Yeah, I heard. So you lost your memory? I see. That means he could actually be from the city. It's very possible. So, you're going to the city? Right. Looks like the dual runner isn't finished. Hope it gets done quickly. It's time. I better get going. Bye! Oh, look at that dual runner. Be careful, you say! Tank and Blitz and Nervin too? Where are they? Three of them are setting up the computer in the room right now. We're looking out for you. Look at those square wheels he's on, chat. Thanks. We'll... Well, take care. Junk will be waiting for you in the city. He's going so fast. Uh, I'm... I, I like running fire decks in these older games because there aren't any Machinas, but I like running Machinas for the most part. If I, can, if I can run a deck with Machinas, I will. I have about three minutes to get through the pipeline and to make it to the hatch on the other side. If I can't do it, the garbage will push me back. Go time. Thanks for letting me know all that useful information, you say. All set? You bet. <laughs> this is 
is how I imagine my viewers watch my stream right here. <laughs> this is every one of my viewers watching my stream right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's playing against CPUs and he's doing so good. <laughs> I cannot confirm or deny. Okay, everyone, please sit down. Wait, what, what the fuck is going on here? Why am I gray? Sorry about that. Don't crash into it. Ah, uh, garbage, watch out. Just a bit more. All right, you did it, you'll say. I knew it. You guys like my voices? You like my voice acting? Dunk, you say got through the pipeline. He made it to the city. You know what, Dunk? I'm gonna help you get your memory back. In fact, we're all gonna help you get to the city. You day a few days later. Ooh, damn, look at him run. Is the, uh, is the board down now? Damn it. God damn it, just jump across the rift in the ground. You'll be fine. Unfortunately, I have to lay down. Oh, it's fine. I understand. You got the ear infection. Oh, yeah, my, my girl voice. I was not very good at that. Dunk, I got my hands on something interesting. Can you use this? Oh, Rally hands you a CPU. What? What the hell? Oh, my God. What the hell? It seems the CPU is a high-performance model. And now you'll be able to ride the Door Runner. There's these two. Rally hands you a riding suit. Ooh. I thought it'd be difficult to ride on the Door Runner in those clothes. So use this riding suit. Now you're ready. Rally, why did you get the CPU and the suit? It's a secret. I totally fucking stole it. Why don't you give it a test ride? If you go on the old highway, you should be all right. The old highway is just ahead of the main road leaving south. You couldn't get to the other side before it, but there should be a bridge you can get by now. All right. Can I change the color of this? I'm not going to ride around in a blue motorcycle. Yeah! What? That's awesome. What? Change the color, baby. All right, what color do we want? What color do we want here? What color do we want? Do we want it all white? Do we want it all white? Do we want it slightly orange? Slightly orange? We want it slightly orange, eh? Can't my dual runner? <laughs> oh my God. Sometimes I can't with you, chat. Oh, Machina Orange? Machina Gear Frame Orange? Huh? Wait, what are we thinking, chat? What are you thinking? Machina Gear Frame Orange? Or should we go straight red? You know what I mean? Like fire red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something like that. You know, like a darker red. Ooh, that looks nice, chat. What do you think? Like a fiery red? The fiery duelist, eh? Doug would sooner play flu than ride on a blue bike. <laughs> Blue's not my color, man. Uh, sounds good. Good. Sounds good. The Machina. Junk go for pink. I'm trying to remember the Machina even come out in this game. No, it come out in 2011. Originally, the parts will have wings and boosters on it. So if you get orange or red, it'll look like a literal firebird. Volcanic red. We're going to go with red. I know it's kind of copying you says, but red's pretty decent. It's a dark red, too. Now, will it show up in the overworld is red? <gasps> no, that is so fire. No pun intended. All right. Uh, Machina has arrived in a reverse of Arcadia. Really? Oh, we're definitely using them then. We're definitely using Machina as a reverse of Arcadia. <laughs> Even if they're really bad. Gear frame is just so busted, man. He's so worth it. I'll do anything for my little Machinas. My little pookies. All right. I think it's time. 
It's time, Chad. It's a blur. As I go by, I can see you dreaming. Ooh, satellite slums, eh? A whole nother set of duelists to grind against. With probably way better cards than me. Let's look around for free shit. Before we get down to business, you know? Oof. You guys creepy? Always look around for free stuff, Jet. I can see you coming. I can feel you breathing. I can feel the wind that's blowing me around. Feel the sun arise and fire in the sky. Greatness thrust itself into our lives. Love, I love Yu-Gi-Oh songs, man. I just wish they were longer. Hyperdrive specifically brings me back to my childhood. I don't know why. It just makes me feel nostalgic for a time in my life, you know? Oh wait, can we buy new bike stuff here? Like immediately? Hold on. Dude, I need that costume. Yo, can we buy these? Holy moly, can we buy these, Chad? I think I want to buy this first one. What about this? Has high endurance, but doesn't handle so hot and has a low load weight. Has great handling and low and load weight making it easy to install options. However, its endurance is low. Hmm. I'm buying it. I'm buying it. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry. I'm buying it. Can I change my bike here? Ooh, I'm sorry, but the computer's totally busted. All right, thanks, man. Dude, our bike just majorly improved like 150 points. Look at this. Yo, look at our new bike. I kind of like it. Yeah, it, it's a, it's got character to it, you know? And it's a two-star frame, a little bit better. Yeah, I like it. I like it. It's it's nothing fancy, but it's it's ours, you know. Very cool. Very cool. All right, let's go test this bike out. I better go fast. This better not be very difficult. Woo! Oh, save. Always. Sa I'm a save whore, chat. Every time I see a save point, sometimes it'll save multiple times. Because I like the way it feels. Isn't this where Crow lives? What is, what's the point of it? Oh. oh my god! 1,500? Oh, chat, let's go! It's time to riding a deer! Oh god, it's, it's veering slightly to the right. Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! Oh god! The controls are not very good. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, chat. Oh wait, hold on. Uh, uh let me switch this. There you go. Now you guys can see all the action of the riding. Of... Oh, oh, speed up. Oh, that's not a speed up. Oh, I thought that was a speed up. Definitely not a speed up. Okay. Hey, we haven't taken any hits. Ooh, speed. That's speed. Woo! Oh my God, I'm going so fast. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh God, I don't like this, Dad. I don't like this. Oh God! Ah! Set of the bitch. Speed is key. Yeah, not crashing is also key. Oh, you see that? 
I'm the best, baby. Don't forget the brakes. What's brakes? I didn't install that in my tool runner. Oh. I should I should have installed it, <laughs> but I don't need it. Oh, we're running out of time. Oh crap. Are we going to make this? What happens if we don't make this? Oh my God. Come on, man. You're embarrassing us in front of all the Yu-Gi-Oh bitches. And all the Yu-Gi-Oh queens, let's go! We did it! We did it! Optimus Power, welcome in! Oh, my memories are coming back. A strong jolt of lightning runs through my head. A fragment of your memory has returned. Ah. Yeah, I'm remembering my past. Yeah. Yeah. I'm remembering a bike in a room. <sighs> You've done all you can, so you better get back to rallying the others. I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. God, we're going to have some grinding to do before we play this again next week. Uh, I think I'm ready to buy some Kadupako. Kadupako. Ooh, nope. I don't want to do with you guys. I want to buy some card packs, baby. Hey, baby. We said this in the DS before I sold it. Some of the, that's one of the things I would regret for the rest of my life. All right. I want to buy more card packs. I heard I got a new card pack. <gasps> no way. I got flaming eternity. Are you serious? Dude, they just want me to build a fire deck. Look at this. Let's buy more of these. We're almost done with the whole pack. Might as well. All right, let's see what we get. Oh! Arm Dragon level 5. That's huge. We have Arm Dragon level 3 already. And we have Mass Dragons. We could definitely add those into the deck. Ultimate Insect. I actually like the Ultimate Insects. Well, this card is on the field is unaffected by the effects of spell cards during your standby phase by sending this face up card to the graveyard. Special summon one level ultimate insect level three from your hand or deck. You cannot add. Oh, I, act, I already opened all the cards. Damn it. You cannot activate this effect to turn this normal summon, special summon, or flip summon. Damn. Okay, we got another one. Oh my god, we have all the arm dragons. We have arm dragon level uh, three, five, and seven. We are definitely running that. Holy shit. And we have a third mass dragon. I think we just found our strategy for the deck for now. Ectoplasmer, another ectoplasmer. Holy shit. Element dragon. Okay, definitely running this card as well. Wow. I guess we're just running dragons for now. <laughs> Charcoal and Patchy, really good card, really good card. Another level three. A third level three mass. Oh my God. Got Holy shit. Oh my God. We are adding in some cards to our deck right now. Let's add them in first. Arm dragon, two arm DMZ's dragons, one arm dragon level seven. I want charcoal and patchy for the stall. I'll take an element dragon. I think that's all I really want. I don't think I really saw anything else that was like, ooh, you, I gotta get this, you know? Well, we gotta get rid of a couple of cards from our deck now. Just some weak crap. I don't really use you anymore, unfortunately. I guess we can get a third Mass Dragon to kind of make up for shit. Uh, Mad Sword Beast we can get rid of. Gaia Power we can get rid of. This is gonna be a grind? Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh yeah, absolutely gonna be a grind, 100%. Uh, since we have Arm Dragon level 5, we gotta get rid of a 1 Tribute Monster. And I think we're gonna get rid of Prime Material Dragon. Sorry, buddy. Um... Let's add in one of the last Mass Dragons here. Yep, 3 Mass Dragons. Perfect! Holy hell! Our deck has gotten so much stronger already. Grand Marge is good. Well, it's just the, the, the ability to set, like pop a set card is just so good. Any end goal in mind of the deck, I want to make a good fire deck. That is my general goal, but for right now, I got to get a good, like a decent deck. Um, 
Let's buy the rest of the cards that we can afford with our card packs here. Now, what I'm noticing is, chat, these four packs must be a lot larger because I have only, only bought from this pack twice and it's already 72% complete. And I bought from this card the entire game and it's only 37% complete. There's probably a lot better cards in here than there are in here. But just to kind of get more level cards, I think Flame Service is somewhere in one of these packs. What? Oh, damn. Let's just finish off as much as we got. This, this one's treating us pretty well. So we'll get the last three card packs from Soul of the Duelist. Maybe we'll get a level six Horus, the Black Flame Dragon. That'd be really good. Master of Oz! Oh yeah, I want a grilled cheese! <gasps> oh, Moby, it's the Frost Monarch! No way! That is really good for some spell and trap removal. Can I get the Stalos, please? Damn, another Ectoplasma. Okay. All right, I definitely want to test out my deck. Drac is in one of the World Championship games for the 5Ds, which are all fired. Not to mention Flame Bell. I want to get Flame Bell eventually, yes. Flame Bell, uh, I don't think Laval's exist yet, which sucks, but I would love Laval's. I think Laval's might be in Tag Force 6. Don't quote me on that. Um, Let's duel this guy. You want to get a taste of how powerful I am, huh? Let's test out our new deck. <laughs> let's go! It ran in 6. Let's go! Now I need his gutter snipe to figure out how all the terrible textures work in that game. So we can do a sprite edit of me, and then I can add myself in the game! Woo! Got a snipe. It's time for your 5 a.m. sprite editing. Yes, dear. <laughs> Woo! I end my turn. There ain't nothing you can play against me that I can't play right back. I am the champion, the people's champ, Hercule! Yeah! All right, I draw. Is it better than your old trash deck? Or is it worse than Nanit? Oh my fucking God, I can't believe this guy's doing this. Uh, it's definitely better than my old deck. Uh, the one that I was playing before this. If you're talking about this game, if we're talking about Tag Force 3, no. This deck is worse. Hell Satan! That's right! Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah! Hell to the champ, baby! Now we get a free attack on this loser. Direct attack! Go! Take this! He's very happy to take that damage. Ow, Tauron! I love uh, Team Four Star. Hell, Satan! Oh, maybe we should. Are you gonna monster reborn my monster to activate its effect against me? Holy hell, he better not get this, man. Do you know how rare it is to get this effect? Dude, you're actually cheating. Holy shit, are you kidding me? Actually cheating. Oh no, now he's got Flame Elf Team. No, I love that card, it's so cool. It's just a better Flame Cerberus. God, I do like Flame Bell. Flame Elf Fiend a lot though. If he does damage, he just does two extra damage for each Pyro in the graveyard. It's just a better Flame Cerberus. But it's level five, it's level six. That's the only difference. <sighs> Come on, man. Give me a, give me a fucking break, key. And also, Dark Sider Carly is hot. Yeah, it's a shame how they killed off her voice actor because she was part of the cult. Indofezo. Dero! Yeah, uh, she was part of the cult, so they, they killed her off. Surprised you didn't know about this. 
Ooh, fire, you gain fire. Okay, I'm gonna tribute summon. I tribute summon my monster! Yeah, uh, the Japanese voice actress for Carly was actually part of a uh, Japanese cult. Uh, and it wasn't like a kill, kill, kill cult. It was like a happiness cult or something like that. And she was just involved in some controversy. So they eventually like wrote her out of the story because they didn't want her to have any more lines. So that's why she's not a prominent uh, part of the story at that first section. Yep, it's pretty fucked up, man. Oh, look who we got, Chad! Of the dragon! Never a trick! Let's go, baby! Ooh, Flame Bell Archer, I want that card. Chuck it up! Yeah, Zinni, chuck it up, baby! Yo, yeah, Arm Dragon! Next turn, you're gonna level up to Arm Dragon level five! I thought it was the dubbed uh, Carly voice actress. I'm pretty sure it's the Japanese. I think it might be the Happiness Cult. Don't quote me on that, because my Yu-Gi-Oh knowledge outside of the actual game of Yu-Gi-Oh is limited. Ooh, level up! Arm Dragon level three, two! Arm Dragon level five! Woo! And then the next turn, I'm gonna get Arm Dragon level seven! Holy hell, chat! Okay, this one gains an additional effect if there's a wind type on the field, and there is. It means I get, if I attack and destroy a monster, it can attack twice, which basically means I win the duel. <gasps> oh, Flame Bell is in this game. Look at that. We do have uh, Carly in the American 5Ds as well, but she gets written out because, you know, it's just a dub of the Japanese anime. Yeah, <laughs> maybe she was deep undercover learning the psychic deck strategy. I don't know about that one. What I do know is our new Jack just stomped the shit out of this guy. Let's go! No flame bell fire dog? Damn. No rekindling, huh? Damn. No tier zero. Woo! Let's go, chat! My deck is popping up! Please give me a little bit more. Oh! We could buy two card packs. Oh man! Sure, I think I'm gonna make it over. I'm gonna make, make, make him a superstar. All right, dude. Let's go buy two card packs, and then we'll wrap things up here. Because I'm sad. We only got four subs today. Wah, wah, wah. That's still a lot. Uh, so we're we didn't reach our sub goal, so we're gonna just end um 30, 45 minutes earlier. Let's buy the last two packs here of Destiny, and see if we can't pull out. A level six Horus the Black Flame Dragon. That'd be freaking epic. Another element dragon. Inferno Fireblast! Ah, uh, yeah! Oh! We got it, Chad! We got it! Oh my god, are you kidding me? That's so awesome! We got Horus! The Black Flame Dragon, level six on the last pack. Let's go! <laughs> I'm built different. All right, now we get we got, we got to get rid of two cards here. I'm gonna get rid of. A lot of these cards help us a lot, but who helps us the least? Oyster Meister. I'm getting rid of the creator and then I'll get rid of this guy. And then we're going to add in some Horus, the Black Flame Dragons right now. Hold on. Boom, boom, boom. All right, we got to get rid of one more card here. I'm getting rid of the Gemini Ancient Gear card, and I'll get rid of Gear Freed. You can't even make equip spells. You can't even rock equip spells. 
Wow. Wow, chat. Our deck is so full of dragons. This baby can fit so many dragons in it. Oh, wait, I wanted to check something real quick. Hold on. I wanted to check the card list. It just said something about card list here. Oh, okay. So once you get to 80%, I imagine you can see what's all in here. Ooh, yep, yep. It even tells you what you're missing. Ninja, uh, Mystic Swordsman level four. Ultimate Baseball Kid, so good. Ojama King is in here. Hammer Shots in here. Innervating Mist is in here and Hollow Life Bear is in here. Null and Void's in here. Okay, so pretty much all we need is the Arm Dragon level level uh, 10 or eight or whatever it is, and then we'll be set. Okay, sweet, awesome. All right, well, we just got like 85% better. Our deck has way more cohesion. I saw Infernal Fire Blast. Yes, you did. All right, stream. Uh, thank you so much for keeping me company today. I really appreciate rocking out and jamming and playing some games while we can all just kind of hang out. You know, what are you doing? So we can all just kind of hang out and have a good time. Uh, so for this stream, it's going to be up on the YouTube channel on the VOD section. So be sure to look out. And until then, gamers, I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to maybe see you guys next time. Thank you so much. And we're going to go ahead and raid my friend, Big Hamu. Big Ham is doing some art right now. Am I still running in the corner? I'm definitely running in the corner. All right. Uh, big raid. Or big... Damn. All right, copy paste this raid message chat. We're gonna go ahead and raid Big Ham underscore VT. Thank you all so much for joining me here today. I can't wait to launch more content in the future. And thank you for sticking around. I really appreciate it. Uh, say hi to Big Ham for me. Have a good night. Oh yeah, swimming the sun.